Hello everybody, and welcome back to the Secret Garden Legacy Challenge! Hi guys! <laughs> welcome on in! How are you guys doing today? How is your Thursday? I hope you're doing well. I'm, I'm a little stressed out. I had a cancel stream yesterday, I just was not, like, I couldn't, uh, I couldn't do it. So, sorry, but I'm here today. And we're gonna we're gonna have some fun. I think it'll be it'll be a good time. Um, I'll I'll make I'll make yesterday up for you guys. I'm, I'm thinking if I have some time on Saturday, we can do some crocheting because I really wanted to crochet yesterday. I was like, oh, I really want to crochet and have some fun. Uh, it 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 pertains to the new pack that got um that got shown today too. I don't know if you guys watched the trailer. I did. I was very excited. I even did a little video on it, which is something I don't normally do, but I was like, I have time. I'm going to do that. So I made a, a, a little video on it today and I was, I had some fun with it. Um, but I'm excited for this new one. The life and death expansion pack looks really fun and I'm excited. So I don't know. I hope you guys are because I'm like, yes, this is this is necessary. This is needed. Um, and we'll have to come up. Maybe we could do like a let's play. We could either do some stuff on stream or I'll do some YouTube stuff. Let me know if you're interested. We could definitely do that. I like it. I think it'd be fun. But I hope you guys had a nice a nice day yesterday and a good day today. So far, we're going to be playing our legacy challenge today. I'm going to turn on my music and turn it up. There we go. Um. And I think it's gonna be a good time. I'm not, I don't have like a lot of plans per se. <laughs> uh, I do think we need to update the house a little bit. And we have some money now that Kyle moved in with us. And then I'm thinking we could start thinking about maybe a wedding between Kyle and, and Rose. I have a feeling it's gonna be Kyle and Rose. Look, we gave Kyle a new, a makeover. He's a little less of a dude bro, a little bit more of a ranch dude bro, which is better, I think. And <laughs> I think that'll work out. I think that's going to work out. But we got to focus on family life. We got to focus on our, our career. We already have saved Strangerville. Um, I don't know. I don't, I don't think that ever changes from Redacted Lab, huh? But we have saved Strangerville from the monster that was taking it over, which is phenomenal. We are now the the Strangerville hero, <laughs> and uh, yeah. So I, I I I think it's just like a fun time for us to hop in, see what everybody's doing. Um, last time actually we did we did renovate our 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 bar here, our saloon. So if you want to see that, you can go look in like the vods and everything. I was thinking of of turning that into a speed build too. So if you guys are interested, let me know. But I think I think that'll be kind of fun. So I think that's actually where they're at right now, which is which I guess we could just like he head straight over there, see what they're up to, um, and then maybe go back home and figure out how we want to finagle it. I don't want it to be like this giant house though in this lot because I do feel like since they are still in like the trailer park area, it still should be a trailer. But I'm just thinking like a double decker. You know, they have like a little loft area for either their room or like a, like an office space could be kind of nice. Maybe their room would make sense to be up top. And then they'd have like an office downstairs, which could also become a nursery. I think that'll be kind of a fun, fun plan. I do want them to move out eventually. I, I haven't been able to figure out to where... Because we can, we can either, like, you know, steal one of these houses. We could take, like, one of the cliffside places could be fun. Or if we want to steal the airplane just to be different. I, I'm not taking away my, my bestie's house. That's that's for sure. But we could always take the, the neighboring home. <sighs> kind of up in the air. But we have to live somewhere here in, in Strangerville. And I do want them to have a, a larger home. One, well, mostly because they're going to have a bigger family. Because they're going to end up with four kids total. And I feel like that's going to be a lot. <laughs> it's going to be a lot for for the small space. But, um, yeah, let's just get into it. Let's get started. Let's have some fun. Uh, button, button, who's got the button? Oh, you guys don't need to see my heart rate. Not today. We're not playing spooky games today. That was Tuesday. Don't worry, we'll play some more spooky games. Do you guys have any suggestions for spooky games? Also, um, throw them out there. 
I love a good suggestion. Oh, a, the best place to put those in the, is in the Discord, because then I can, like, see them and remember. I have a horrible memory sometimes. Sometimes I talk for three hours and I have no idea what I've said. <laughs> I feel like that's normal, right? <laughs> that's normal, right? All right, let's head over to the Goldilocks zone, which is what we built last time. I'm super proud of this build. I love how it came out. And I do love the name, so a shout out to Noah for helping me name it. <sighs> tired. I'm so tired and a little stressed. Sorry if my energy is just not there. I'm. This is me just trying to like zone out into the game. Sims is like one of my my favorite places to to come and just pretend the world doesn't exist for a little while. <laughs> That's kind of what I need to do today. <laughs> So we're going to truly just immerse ourselves in, in Rose's world. We aren't going to do the Reaper event. I am doing that on, on um, YouTube. If you guys want me to do it with you guys, I will. You know, because I think it is kind of silly and fun. So I guess like when, once the, the weeks get really far into it, maybe we could do it together because then we can do a lot of it all at once. I think that would be fun. Um, but I am, I am doing that separately. So this is the Goldilocks zone, if you didn't get to see it last time. I love how it came out! This is the saloon on this side. In the middle we have a little clock shop. And then on the right side we have a little gym area, which used to be like the sheriff station. Which I think is actually, this is going to be a super useful place for us, so we're probably going to be here a lot. But I like that we have a little area to work out, hang out, and then this, is, this was just for fun. It was just a lot of fun. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I, I enjoyed that. And then upstairs we have a little gaming area um, and bathroom. Out back we do have a place for horses. And then if you are sneaky and you find find out something, you know, there's there's a little storage space downstairs with some nefarious activities that could possibly happen down there as well. Anyways, <laughs> let's see what these two are up to. I feel like Kyle had a very nice makeover, if I do say so myself. I'm not that great in Cass, all right? So I think I did a good job. Oh, yeah, they had an amazing date, didn't they? Oh, you're an artist. I don't remember that. Let me move myself over a little bit so you guys can see. I don't want to get in the way. But I didn't realize he was an artist. <laughs> well, I mean, that's fine. I, I, that does mean that we have to get home because uh, it looks like he has to actually get to work. So let's go home. Kyle can go off to, to work. I love that that's his dream job because we did have him like say, why don't you go into your dream job, Kyle? And his dream job was to be an artist. And I think that's kind of lovely. Oh, so that means that in their, their office space, we'll have to put a little art, like arts and crafts uh, corner. <laughs> Okay, Kyle. You, let's see. Oh, you don't have to go to work? Oh, work in 24 hours. I thought he had to go to work. I mean, it said go to work when we were at the saloon, so I guess it's fine. So this is our home. And what I'm thinking, right, is I was like, oh, well, we do have this, like, lifted already. If we just, like, lift it a little higher... We could add a space up top here. And then I was thinking we could add a little balcony area on this side where we could put the the telescope. I thought that would be a good spot for it. And then maybe we can redo the siding. Because we have 30 grand right now. That's a lot of money. So let me just do a quick renovation. And when I say quick, I'm going to actually try to make it quick. Because I, you know me. Ooh. Our color is red. Should we put like the bright red siding on it? I'm kind of thinking we should put the bright red siding. Because I don't think, I don't think this one has like a better color, right? Oh, what if we did this? It's a little more subtle. Is that, is that better? Or do we go just go all out and make it like that bright red? Because I kind of like the bright red. I'm not going to lie. This one still looks kind of brown. Hmm. 
I kind of like the the small like striping in this too because there's this one and then there's this one that really looks like a container. I'm thinking like this just looks, looks like it's like sheet metal or something. And I don't know, in Rose's mind, it maybe it blocks out aliens and and all of that so they can't get into our home. <laughs> Let me come up with a ridiculous backstory quick. Uh, where do we want this to come back to? I was kind of wondering if we're going to need to put in, like, a ladder. I'm thinking the ladder into the new space might be the easiest so let's see oh there's like a pink ladder wait that's kind of cute i can have a pink ladder which means then that could come here i'll move the windows because i'm gonna do the same thing up top here but i wanted to build the room first and then i, I figured this would end up being like a hallway of sorts <laughs> so we'll have like a door that comes out and we'll have a balcony maybe and then I don't know if this looks ridiculous but I, I'm just gonna I'm gonna roll with it and then you guys can make fun of me that's that's totally fine I don't know if it looks too much much like a shoe it might look like a shoe I just I wanted to make sure that they had enough space <laughs> I love their family, and I want them to have enough space. Oh, does that look better on the, around the edges? No, I like I like the the edging we do have on the bottom. Up top here, though. Hold on a second. Oh wait, we could put these on either side, and one of them could become a door. But I was thinking, if we put this here, I don't think we set this, oh, we did have this set to a tiny home. That's all right. What did it just get rid of? I feel like it deleted stuff and I actually have no idea what it's, what it's deleting. It doesn't look like it's actually getting rid of anything. So I'm going to be hopeful that um, we're fine. <laughs> but I figured if I did that, we could put a nice like border around it so it kind of looks like we added on this up here it's so tall now it's so tall now i can't tell if it looks ridiculous ah. you know what i don't care you can be ridiculous we're allowed to have ridiculous things right too tall. This might be the, the right height. Hmm. It might be too... It might be too thin to have up here. Unless we... Well, we could have it just like that. You know, sometimes I come up with ridiculous ideas. We have the Goldilocks uh, saloon, and then I have this, and I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> it becomes a little outrageous. We could do that instead. This could probably hang over to give this a little bit more shade there. But then we have like a uh, a little balcony. Why did they get rid of? There we go. Is that is that nice? Is that good? I don't know if it's good. I liked I liked my original um, trailer. This one's just becoming a bit funky. But I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna keep going with it. If we end up hating it. I won't keep this upstairs part portion. <laughs> I promise. But for now, I'm like, well, might as well just go all in, right? Stay all in and see what happens. Let's see. 
go here. I, I'm thinking bigger windows up top too, but I don't know. She She's probably going to be like, you know what, Kyle? I do not like having uh, such a tall house. I prefer going deeper into the ground. They're going to want to get like a A ranch style up on the hill, but then they have like a basement. I feel like that could be something that they'll end up wanting to do. Let's see. What door? Maybe something like this could be good. Has a lot of windows. I mean, honestly, we could do like something where there's more windows in that section. I don't know if that's, you know what, maybe? I don't know what I'm doing today. You know what? <laughs> it's one of those days where my builds are gonna look stupid. I feel it. It's fine. Let me take this window instead. I think this will be better. We can put two vertical windows. And then we can put a... Like a flower box underneath or something. I think this is way better. There we go. See, I think that's nicer. You know, it's a it's a cute little space. We could either put a chair up there with this, but I do love the idea of having our uh, telescope up top. So we're definitely gonna keep that up here. Hey, it's, you know what? It's actually kind of fancy. It's growing on me. I'm keeping it. You guys can't stop me. You no longer can stop me. <laughs> I went from being like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. If if it's awful, we'll, we'll change it. And then I'm like, no, screw you guys. I'm keeping it. I'm keeping it. All right, so we have to have this door here. And we'll bring all of this up top too. Walls, and then what else? What else? We'll keep the bathroom down here, but we'll move the bedroom up. Oh no! Wait, it got rid of all of our stuff on there. Oh no! Oh good. Okay. <laughs> I was like, no, I bought that specifically. That's mean. Why would you do that to me, game? And then it's fine. Everything's fine. <laughs> Move this. Okay, so I was gonna leave this down here. We'll make a little art area up top. Uh, I'm wondering if we're going to need like another side table. Let's see, where do we wanna put everything? I'm. Mean, you know what, I'm gonna keep this down here. We can. We can always add a couple more things into this room. Dun, 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 dun. But I like I like having all this stuff together because it's it's really cute. Oh shoot, is that actually? Oh no, that's that's fine. I don't think it's floating, is it? It might be floating a little bit. <laughs> Are we gonna worry about it too much? Nah, nah, this is fine. All right, so we need to get the shades up there. Very good. And then probably just some of the saucer lights. Top here and one in here. Now I'm thinking this? Do we have? Aha! We'll put it here for now. I kind of like the idea of that being there. We What we could absolutely do though is make this a part of the bedroom. So now they can actually reach this box if they wanted to get some decorations out of it we we could oh oh but the window shoot 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 i mean i guess if we just kind of shove this over ah come on i think that's fine right or does it need to be go over maybe it needs to go over one more so it doesn't look too silly from the inside. Does this need to be smaller still? 
I liked it big. I'm not going to lie. I like it big. I think it still fits with the door. If they can't get in out here, then we can change it. But I, I kind of like it like this. And then either... Either we'll put Kyle's art stuff outside or we're going to put it downstairs in the office. I think either way it would be okay. I mean, I guess he could have one in both sections, right? We could have, like, a little place for him to do art up here. And then maybe he has, like, a little... Maybe he does, like, digital art. So he has a little spot in the office to do digital art. Because what other... What other... I have it up. Where'd it go? For our traits, let's see... For our other skills, it's fitness, logic, and parenting. That's what we have to master, right? So Kyle can do whatever the hell he wants, but we have to master those few different skills. So let me see. I might move this to here. We'll move you maybe to here. Our little gnome guy can go there. Honestly, we have a lot of gnomes now. Uh, we'll put the bear here and the little swimmer here. Why do we have... What is this? What is this? Can I... You know what? Is this actually selling them? I don't think it is. I don't, I don't, I don't think I got any money for that. You know, people were using my stuff. <laughs> I feel like I have the right to sell that. But I'm thinking we could put our workout equipment in the yard. That's... I think that's okay, right? Or does it look really dumb just, like, sitting in the yard like this? Because, I mean, I didn't mind having it in the back, but... You know what? No, this is, like, their thing. Well, this is her thing. Go. Because otherwise we can put this here, but I kind of like that this is on the out of, outside of the little makeshift yard that we have. So that's actually kind of cute. That's much better. Also, let me let me freshen up the terrain paint. <laughs> I find it a little necessary to give them some. Oh, undo. Let's get some like flowers. Ah, uh, see that? That looks a little bit nicer. Than just green. Green with envy. Just adds a little bit of, like, flowery looks to it. I like that. Let's see. Yeah, that- I think- I feel like that's a little nicer. But I do want to make sure... It's not coming too far out. Or we can always... Ah, no. Wait. Uh, maybe... I wanted something to look a little trampled, but I guess this kind of does already. Or we could have, like... Nah, nah. I'm just gonna leave it. We're gonna leave it. So I feel like that looks a little bit nicer here. We have our lovely mother plant there. The house looks... You know, it, to me, looks really, like, cute. I I kind of like it. I'm gonna go up a little taller with that. And then, oh wait, you know what? Let's remove... So we can actually get the lighting from outside. I'm okay with this. Uh, and I'm gonna, we're just gonna pretend this is on the ceiling still. I know it's, like, not technically there, but... You know what? No, screw it. Screw it. I'd rather, I think I'd rather have, like, a ceiling than have it opened. Because should we... Should we have them a matching ceiling? Or is that gonna be, like, too much? We could do, like, a paneling. It could be more like this. We could see what that looks like, because I'm I'm wondering if that would look... Oh, wait. Did I... I want the ceiling, and then... Because it's the same floor, so maybe if we do the same floor... 
I don't know if that would darken the room or make it actually just feel a little bit more finished. Should we find out? No, I'm okay with this. It's wood on wood on wood, and that's what we want. <laughs> that's what we want, all right? That's what you get. I want a different light. I like that we have a little bit of money to, to, to screw around right now. <laughs> uh, uh, I was looking, I was thinking this one. Yes, I think it has to be that one. I don't know why, I just kind of love it. So we'll keep that there. And then maybe up here too, we could have like the same light next to this door. Perfect. What's it look like at night? Yeah, I feel like that gives a, a good amount of light for those locations. Now, the one other thing that I kind of want to do is bring it out one tile so we can have a bit more of a, a living space. Like, we probably could fit a, a couch, potentially? This is definitely no longer a tiny residence, is it? Oh no, it is it's only 90 tiles, so it's still kinda of, it still it still counts. It's not tiny, but it's small. <laughs> that counts. Alright, so if I move this stuff around a little bit. That can go there. I'm gonna put her badges of honor into the living or the living space, into the the study area. And I was kind of wondering if we should put this more so in the corner. Like this. I think all of this is still usable, right? Now I can actually put her laptop in there, too. No more crappy carpet. No idea what I actually want in here, though. I'm feeling like it should be a red. For the rose red. We could get the nice version. Because <laughs> we had this one. And then there's the nice version of it. I mean... That could work. Oh, here's like an antique rug. It says it's mysterious. Mysterious origin. Perfect. This whole, this whole thing is mysterious, right? We're in Strangerville. I feel like they should have gotten a mysterious rug. Uh, I don't know if your beanbag chair is going to fit anymore. We could put that in the office, too. Maybe we'll put a little table next to it. Am I going to be able to fit a couch is the question. See, I like our, our accordion doors, but it makes it so we can't actually use this. Let me see something. We could widen this guy, right? Have this still somewhere out front, or we could put it up top now, honestly. Make it like a, a decorative piece on the roof. Would that be more... I kind of like that. <laughs> I kind of like how that looks, like a decorative piece up top. Uh, I gotta fix this though now, because I keep, I keep changing the size of everything. Yeah, I kind of like it. Because when they drive it, it's like right there. <laughs> I don't know about driving a double-decker, but you know... Sometimes you just got to. What I'm thinking now is just putting the the table out front. And then we can move... Oh, I can't move that yet. Hold on. It's covered, which is why I'm thinking it'll be okay. Is Because then we can just kind of do this and keep it covered. And then... Now I can actually fit, like, an actual couch in here and then maybe we could move this window to the, the sink that can go here that's better that's better and we'll, we'll even get them some some better appliances here too and then if i move that over is that okay yes because that's still like in the middle 
kind of what we were going for. Okay, let's see. Couch wise. I don't know what their style is. Hmm. Because I kind of went a little modern, a little silly. I don't know. Maybe not, but two. <laughs> we could get something like this. Like, to me, that's a very rose color. Which then I probably will have to change the, the carpet. <gasps> Wait, this has roses on it, though. Wait! I think I have to go with the one with roses on it. That's kind of perfect. All right. Well, now I can get the rose-colored couch. And in that case, now I have to move this over one. But I, I what? A, I mean, that's cozy. That's very cozy. Kind of like it. <laughs> kind of like it. We could even have this bump out. Hmm. I'm kind of thinking I might do that. Wait, that has to go over one more. One more. This keeps moving because I keep moving and like shifting stuff on the sides. But I'm thinking if we bump this guy out, you can put a full shower and, and even like a tub in the back here. It becomes a lot more functional. I might just put that there. We'll keep it with the same stuff for now until I know I have like enough money, but I, I kind of like that. Then this place is becoming way bigger. I don't know what to put for the roof though. Maybe just this. Is that funky looking? Maybe. Hold on. It's either going to be that. I guess it could be this one. This actually might be better because it has the flat side to it. Okay. Even have it hang out? Nah, I don't like the hanging out. That's okay. We could do this though. We'll, we'll flatten it a bunch. I think that's better. Oh, I can't get. I can't. Collect the siding. I think it's it's not even nighttime. Why do I have it still on night? Uh, there we go. I think it's just a black. It's either the black or the gray. It's black. Da, 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 da. I might need a thicker one on this part though, because it looks a little silly. Yeah, that's better. That's much better. Okay. So we're a little bump out in the back for the bathroom. We're getting a lot nicer stuff, which I think is great. They deserve to have a really cute home. I always use this as a coffee table. It does. I don't even think it really functions as a coffee table. <laughs> To be quite honest, but like some of these are so big. I don't want a giant coffee table. I want a little one. But I'm not like a huge fan of how this one looks. I love this. This is what I wanted for my coffee table. I guess we could do something like this. Uh, it still feels huge. Oh wait, here. How about this one? Just get it in like the black so it kind of matches. But then they should still be able to like sit here. And let's see. Kind of like the plants. I don't know. I have no style for this person. I just kind of like, yeah, whatever she finds. Maybe that's what it is. It's kind of like, oh, I like this. I'll get it to work in my house. And then <laughs> she just gets it anyways. Like, ah, yes, I love this lamp. Um, Probably should have her go to like the flea market or something. Because I feel like that could be fun. This is a weird lamp and I want it. I want the weird lamp. Let's see. What else can we put in here? If I just type in the word rose. 
We could get a cute trellis. I would be all right with this. Would it work anywhere? <laughs> they have like some roses. There's this rose. Maybe this could be, nah. Maybe this could be in here. Just a big old rose. You could make it like a black one. And then what else? Anything else? I mean, there's this big old bouquet, which could be kind of cute. Did Kyle get us a bouquet? We could put that on the table here. I, I have to get a freaking desk. Hold on a second. <laughs> I'm over here like, oh, I keep wanting to move this. And then I go, oh, but I need a desk. And then I forget to move it again. Uh, So this is like the Strangerville one. I don't think anything really came with Strangerville. So I'm, I'm kind of wondering if we should get this one. I kind of like this desk actually a lot. We could get it in the red color. Or if we wanted things to be a bit more matchy, we could get this one. Does this work? I don't know, maybe that doesn't match. I see, I'm just, I'm struggling to figure out the style I want to go with. Because I'm not like super embracing like the full on like this would probably be the style, right? But then some of the stuff looks a little modern. So like we have this crazy desk here. Tis my problem. We could do this one. This is like simplistic. Maybe that works. I'm gonna go with that. The struggle is real. Oh, wait, we have to get the Strangerville chairs, though. Yeah, that's much better. That feels better. <laughs> uh, let's put this on this side, then. This can be on the desk. This could be in the corner. And then we can finally move the laptop into here. I think that's better. You know, we can just have it as, like, an office space for now until, you know, the inevitable child is born. I, d I do like how this is becoming very cozy. I might have to change the bed. We'll see. Okay. Appliances-wise, we still have a good amount of money. I want, I want to upgrade at least a smidge. I don't mind them having the black appliances. I feel like it matches a little bit nicer. Ooh, what if we get this one? That looks fancy. Let's get that one. Counters might need a bit of an upgrade. Oh, we could go with these. Ooh, or these. No, I want these. I want these counters. We need a corner, and then we need an end. Oh, do we want one that's a little fancier? Yeah, yeah, we do. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> we could get, which one is it? Is it this one? Yeah. We could then get like some cabinets. I don't want to get too many though, or it's going to get a little, hmm. You know what? Nah. We'll skip the cabinets for now. We could get, like, open cabinets, right? We could have, like, the, the shelving in here, just so we have some space for some stuff. Let's see. I think I'm gonna have to go with these. Isn't there one that's for the corner? Hold on. Hold on. Or is that just the cabinet up top? Hold on. I know. I've seen it. There it is. Ha ha. So then we can kind of do this. I don't know why they're different colors. I actually don't think they are different colors. It just looks that way. 
Uh, but we'll do that. Oh, I know what we have to use. The new colors! Yes! Oh, it makes me so happy that they gave us some new colors on these. I was so excited when I saw the new colors for all of these. We, I was desperate for it, honestly. Because sometimes you start playing this game, you're just like, oh my god, there's no colors! I need them! I'm kind of wondering if it should be... This? Is that too low? We could probably go up a little bit higher. I just don't want it to peek through. No, I think that's actually good. Yeah. So right there. I like it. Do we want... I mean, I guess we could go... If we wanted to brighten it up in here, we could go with like a white up top. Or try to match the walls. I feel like that's also an option. I hate that the corner one is a different color. I think we'll stick with black with those and then a white uh, hood, event hood, right? I think that's that's good. Do we want... Well, I mean, we could clutter it up. We could. Because then we can just put, like, some cute stuff in here. Oh, look at the gay sky, little penguin. <laughs> I love the little penguin. Oh, yeah, I have the freezer bunny because I started the, <laughs> the event. Um, can we get a chicken? Is there, like, a rose-colored chicken? Hmm. Aw, little lovebirds. Aw. <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know what I really want to clutter the space up with. I guess just like plates and, and things might be might be a little bit better. Is that going to be too high up and it's going to be like in the ceiling? Yeah. Dang it. Because I do want to put it lower, but I feel like if I put it lower, I can't have this one because it goes through the, the fridge then. I guess that could be on the counter instead. Get a couple of those. I'll fix it later. <laughs> I'm just looking to see what else I want to put in. Oh, you know what? I like a fire detector. I love a good fire detector. I'm going to put it right here. Because I actually think that'll be helpful. I also want to give them the therm thermo thermostat. Oh my god, I couldn't speak for a second. Sorry. Thermostat. Um, let's see. What else? What else? Let's go to decorations. We'll clutter it up. We'll make it look fun. Hmm. Honestly, we could have a, we could have more counter space. If we really wanted another counter space, we could absolutely have some more counter space here. And then we could just put the the bin there. That's fine. I actually like that cuz then it gives us more space and more clutter that we can kind of mess around with. So we can put this here have this over here. Actually, let's just put these together. It always looks nicer when they're together. And they can still use that counter. You know, I like how I said, I'm not going to spend a ton of time on this. We're an hour in. I haven't done gameplay. I should probably just try to do this a little bit quicker, but I'm having too much fun. I love building in The Sims, all right? You can't stop me from enjoying my time here. I like a little casserole dish. That's kind of fun. Ooh, a veggie bowl. <laughs> we don't have a ton of space. I probably shouldn't be doing too many. Uh, You know what? We're like the peppers and stuff. Ooh, should we get a little alien? I'll put a little alien up there. <laughs> I just kind of like... 
being like, oh yeah, we'll just put some aliens around the place. Oh, the plates could be good. Hold on, where are where are the plates? I'm thinking of the ones from like Mount Komorebi. Oh, I kind of like that for the bathroom. I might do it. I might put this in the bathroom. Oh, you know what? Keep that there. This could be like the soap, soap dispenser. But then we have that for there. What else? <laughs> what else? What else? <laughs> oh, actually, you could be in the corner. I like the casserole dish in the corner. It's, it's probably good enough for now. I do really want to clutter up the top, but I don't want to spend all of our money. That's my problem. <gasps> Can we get this guy? I don't know why. Just because. I'm, I'm going to put him here. <laughs> I need to get all the Strangerville stuff. Oh, here we go. We could put these in. The spices. Can they go up top? Yeah, perfect. I feel like I'm missing where the dishes are, and I don't know why. It's the ones that are, like, stackable. We could even put some of these in here, like a cookbook. And then... Hmm. Get the teapot. It comes in a really pretty color, right? We love a, we love a good color, colorful teapot. <laughs> Let's see. Bum, bum, bum. There we go. Oh, how about the dishes? We could put the dishes up here too. Yeah, that I, I feel like that actually kind of works. Or, or should that one be on the lower shelf? Oh, I guess I can't. Oh, actually having them like that, that's actually fun. Yes. <laughs> Happy accident. Let's go. No, I want to go on the bottom shelf. Why will it only let me do the top shelf? Like, what the heck? Fine, I'm putting them there anyways, then. One of these days. There you are. I found them. Then we can put the dishes here. Oh, does that have a little flower on it? I like this color. I think I'm gonna go with this one. It kind of matches the, the casserole dish. <laughs> and then we can put, aha, there we go. There, that, I feel like it's cluttered enough. I feel like that adds a, enough interest up top to make it worthwhile. So then we have our nice little seating area. We have a little eating area outside. The kitchen is updated. What else do we want to do? Oh, the bedroom. <sighs> I'm like not feeling the bed anymore. This was like the bed I chose right at the beginning. Like, ah, yes, this is the bed I want, but I don't know. Does the one from the new pack actually work better? Maybe. I kind of like this color. I kind of like that color, I think, better. I think I'm gonna go with it. And then, do we want another side table? We could, we could do this as the side table. What's the one that came with the pack? Does anything match? This one? I feel like I would get it in the black anyways. Does that make sense? We could put their we could put their little picture on here. That's cute. No, turn, dang it. Why can't I turn it? Okay, fine, I'll just turn this. Uh <laughs> put that in the corner and then we can Oh, then this is actually where the the clock could go. I feel like that makes a little bit more sense too. So we'll have their clock and their picture. That up there, and then let's see. Maybe a mirror?
feel like it just has to be one that either goes on the wall. Oh, that one's actually kind of nice. I think it's too big, though. <laughs> I feel like it has to go on the wall. It has to be one that's actually connected. Or it's just going to feel like it's in the way. I might go with that. Go with this one. No, I like the roundness of that one. I think it's better. So we'll put it there behind the door. I mean, technically, I could probably put, like, another TV in here, too, so they have something to look at, but... I like how I'm kind of embracing the pinks and the reds at this point. <laughs> I was thinking more, like, red rose, but at the same time, like, the red looks great outside, but then, like, inside, we kind of have a lot of, like, the pinks for the main stuff. We have red uh, accessories, red roses, and then a little bit more, like, pinks and reds in the bedroom. I think that's fine. I'm all right with this. Should we get the... We might as well just go all in on the new pack stuff, huh? Get the new rug. It's got it's got pretty colors. That's great. All right. I like it. I feel like it's working for us. Is there anything else I'm going to want to switch up? Well, I think this is good enough for now. We have the bathroom, probably needs more updating. We'll end up doing some more in this room here. Uh, we have this whole room is done. We have some money left. We have a lot of money left, to be quite honest. But I do want to make sure that this is actually usable, too. So, my lovely Rose, can you please come up here? Very good. Yay! Okay, good. It works. That's all I wanted to make sure. And I'm pretty sure everything out here is going to work, too. So can you guys come sit out here? Kyle, can you come over here and maybe uh, clean out the food and then maybe serve us breakfast? <laughs> make us some eggs and toast. I like it. I like how that came out. I think it's actually kind of cute. Good. I'm glad. <laughs> so after, you know, saving Strangerville, we were able to do a little bit of an update, which I think is great. Oh, I didn't know you were going to pass out on me. You were upstairs. Why didn't you just go to sleep? What's wrong with you? Kyle needs to work on his art skills, because I love that. He's also a painter extraordinaire. Did I do that? Did I do that? Or did the game do that? I think the game did that. Friendly voice. Aw, his clears have become his goals have become clear in his mind. Oh, that's kind of cute. I love that. Cause what what are your traits? You're a genius, clumsy, and lazy. Aw. I don't know why that's cute to me. Look, Kyle's growing on me. I know sometimes you're just like, oh, God, Kyle Kyleson. But then at the same time, it's like, oh, Kyle. <laughs> All right, let's see. Why are you cleaning in here? Let me set sink type to kitchen, bathroom. That should help. So he's going to make some food this morning. And since he doesn't work today, I might just have him work on his art stuff up on the balcony. You do need to go for a jog, but I'd rather you get some sleep first. So she's going to get some sleep and then we can get to, to work after that. We also probably should go on another date. I think that's a good idea. They're actual partners, right? I don't, I don't know whether they're partners or they just moved in together. Partner. Okay, good. So they are actually partners. We're very satisfied in this relationship, and I absolutely adore it. Um, close from moving in. That's actually really cute. I love it. They're they're super into each other. I don't feel like they would have a big wedding. What do you guys think? Because I, I kind of feel like they're not going to want, like, a big old fancy wedding. 
she's like a paranoid sim that kind of keeps to herself, you know? I mean, she is the hero of Strangerville, but I don't know. In my head, I feel like if they're going to get married, right? And I have a feeling they're going to get married. Uh, they'd probably do like a courthouse wedding, which can we just pretend the library is the courthouse and then they just get married there? <laughs> I don't know if I want to do, like, a big old fancy wedding. Oh, good. Yay! I love that this is working. This is very cute. You'll have to come out here and get some food once you're, once you're sleeping. Or once you're done sleeping. Kyle, once you're done eating, you're gonna go up and work on your, uh, your skills. Figure painting? Classic painting. Uh, let's go. Well, you, you start with a small classic painting, you know, to get yourself warmed up. I think that's fine. There we go. I like it. Do you have a tattoo or what is that? Oh, yeah, you do have a tattoo. I didn't even... I don't... I don't remember him having the tattoo, but I like that he has a plum bob on his arm. <laughs> Stop bouncing, game. I'm fine. Oh, he's drawing a flower! This is the secret garden legacy! He, he truly wants to be a part of this. That's why he's drawing a flower right now. <laughs> that is why he's painting a flower. You need a little bit extra sleep. I'm going to let her keep sleeping. I She does need a jog, though, before work is over. You know what? Here, wake up, get something to eat, and I'll have you jog now. Is he just doing push-ups? All right. Oh, we have to keep this. It's like a crappy painting, but I feel like he did this for her. It's not a rose, and I don't, I don't know if that matters too much, but I love it. So we're keeping it. Here, do a figure painting. Oh, I should get him inspired, shouldn't I? What is this? Everything does not seem to be going Kyle's way at all lately. It has been bad news after bad news. People keep saying, you never know until you try, but never talk about how it feels after trying something new and it not working out. Kyle can't take another disappointment. It's terrifying and too painful to try again. Oh, Oh, Kyle, I'm sorry, bud. <laughs> I didn't know you were failing that much. Is it just because you made one poor painting? I mean, it's not a big deal. You, know, you have to start somewhere. It does kind of suck, but at the same time, you know, you start getting better. And then, and then you feel better about it. I wanted to fix this really quick. Don't mind me. I'm... I'm always just messing around with everything. <gasps> There's like a rose gold. Yeah. I gotta go with the rose gold. Also, I just really wanted to use the new door. I'm gonna be kind of obsessed with this. Oh, we could do like a full tile inside here. <gasps> Should we? Oh, maybe that's like too much, but this is kind of fun. Yeah, I think we'll do a full tile inside of the actual shower area. But there is a door. This one. You can get in the rose gold color. Hee <laughs> hee. I like that. I like that a lot. Actually, maybe we don't need to do a full wall height. We do this one. I feel like that feels more like a real shower then. That it has like an opening up top. Is that weird or is that good? I think it's... I, th I feel like that's good. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stick with it. If, if we end up hating it, I just change it, you know? I'm flexible with these things. I can do that. All right, but he can come in here and take a thoughtful shower. Because you do need to paint while th thoughtful. While inspired, not thoughtful. <laughs> Stop telling me to do the grim stuff. I yeah, I love the grim stuff. I love grim. Do you guys... Yeah. I've shown you guys my grim before. I've posted him on my Instagram. I love my grim. For anybody who's here and also does my crafting with me, this is we're gonna work on my a grim pat my grim pattern. Um, because I do wanna sell these. So if you guys if anybody wants a grim, 
my commissions are open. <laughs> I am making Grimm's. All right, so he's he's relaxing because he's super freaking tense because he has a feel of fa fear of failure now. Oh, she's back to sleeping. You know, I was gonna have you go jogging, River. A uh, rose, rose. Uh, where is it? Mar no, go jogging. Go take a jog quick. Kyle's done here, and then I'm gonna have you go back up. Keep. Oh, you can't because you're too tense. Well, how can I make you less tense? Is it would it help you to work out? Here, come out come out here and work out then. Or I guess I could have you like watch some TV. That could work too, right? Maybe you like the home decorating network. <laughs> or like a reality dating uh, TV show. Here, watch a telenovela. No, that totally feels like a Kyle thing. All right, good. So she did her thing for the day, got paid. What else do we want to do? I mean, I should really let them sleep and like just get some stuff done. But I do need to get her fitness skill up. Oh, didn't we get a, a book to read? We should read some of our books. We have a ton of books. We have all of our conspiracy theory books, and then I wanted her to read a parenting book as well. Didn't I get one of those? Let's see. Oops. Yeah! Here, take that one too. Oh, you can come over, Jess. That's fine. You can teach me some parenting, because I wanted to learn some more. Oh! Oh, you are so pregnant! Look how pregnant you are! Yes! No, I love it. I love it. Give her a big old hug. Because you guys are besties. I don't want to give a speech. <laughs> Can we give some affection? I want to give some, I want to give a hug. Oh, I'm so excited. Wait, why are, why are you hugging from across? Stop that. I just love it. Because it's, it's, to me, it's one of those things where it's like, we, we saved Strangerville. Our friend is now like, we're going to expand the family because we saved Strangerville. And it's just kind of lovely. And and Rose is thinking, oh, I kind of, I kind of want to have a family too. I really want a big family. What is this? Excruciatingly fatigued? Oh, dude, go watch some TV. What did I tell you to watch? A telenovela? Do that. Where's that? Here, go watch some TV. Relax, watch some TV, do your thing. I, I, I don't, uh -huh. can you, can you paint now? Okay, good, at least you can paint. I don't care that you're fatigued. <laughs> I'm mean, all right? I don't care that he's fatigued. Go, go do your painting. Uh, let's see, let's see. So she's learning a little bit of parenting, which I think is nice. Because she's thinking about it a lot. And now her friend is here. <gasps> Should we ask the baby's due date? Wait, is that a real thing or am I just being an ass? No, don't give a rose. We're not being romantic. Is this, is this mischievous? No, that's real. Do it. Yay. Oh, we're so stinky. I didn't realize how stinky she was. Aw, that was actually like a nice little react, like... Uh, interaction with them. Can we make you... Oh, ask to feel baby! Become baby crazy! Get the baby fever! <laughs> I think it's necessary! We're so stinky! Aw. I love that. I love it so much. Let's see though, cause she, my poor Sim, my poor Sim is, is so tired. So why don't you take, you could take a brisk shower and then I might have you just go to bed early tonight. How, Kyle, how's that painting coming? Oh, you're so good. You know, you're getting the basics down. 
you're 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 seeing the shapes and and how uh how large and small they should be and like the basic sim i like it i'm not being a jerk that's where you all have to start sometimes all right you start off figuring out line placement don't be mean to kyle You can absolutely just sell that to a collector. I feel like someone would love that. That's fine. You're inspired once again, so I'm happy about this, because this is exactly what I wanted. Here, do another small painting. Let's see if he does another flower. <laughs> he might. Whoa! What are you doing down here? She's, like, doing some drop kicks. Dang! She is way better at that than I, like, was expecting her to be. Holy cow. Do more drop kicks. Oh. <laughs> that was cool to see. That was very cool to see. What is she doing now? She's gonna go talk with her imaginary friends. Okay. Okay. Wait, didn't I have her take a shower? Why is she still stinky? Stop getting stinkier. Go to bed. Well, maybe I actually will have them, like, woohoo or something beforehand. <laughs> Hopefully he finishes his painting before she's ready to go to bed. Nice! Sell that one as well, because I don't think we want to keep that one. That one's not gonna... <laughs> I am partial to keeping things when it comes to my Sims creations. It's just like me. I always want to keep all of my creations. Okay, well, they're gonna go woohoo. I don't know if you really want to stick around, Jess, but... I mean, to each their own, right? Oh, he put on the silky pajamas for that one. Yeah, she's like, I probably should get going. Oh, I need to make you some more friends, Kyle. You only have two people in yours. <laughs> Rose knows, like, everybody. I guess we could have, like, a party or something eventually. That could be fun. Oh, why? No, what are you gonna say? We're not in compliance. Get out of here. Oh! There's some feathers everywhere. What's the matter? Why are you freaking out? No, don't nap lazily. Come up here and just sleep. Now he's gonna go downstairs to go back upstairs. All right. Wait, why can't you? Okay. I was like, why can't you sleep? What's the problem here? You can have the right side of the bed. And I think, I think she has the left side of the bed. Well, I guess she has both sides of the bed. Whatever. It's fine. This guy needs to go away. I know I'm not in compliance. Go away. I'm afraid this household isn't in compliance. Blah, blah, blah. I might just... Should I just get rid of that? I don't... <sighs> actually, actually, I'm kind of thinking they could... They could... Get some solar panels. I'd be alright with this. They could get some solar panels up on the roof and then they will be in compliance for next time. Oh. That- nope, stop it. I feel like that's actually kind of a fun idea is that they get some- get a couple of sol solar panels. I mean, they live out in like the desert area. I feel like that's actually really good. Should this come up to here? On this wall, too? Like, it actually matches with it? Oh, God. <laughs> maybe maybe I, this doesn't have to come all the way down. Maybe that goes there. This comes in just a smidgen more. Because I like that this, this does this, but I'm over here now. I kind of need a new overhang. Because I wanted that to be undercover. I liked the idea of it being undercover, at least. So maybe we just need to get, like, um, some sort of pergola. A pergola moment. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, here. This one. This one could be perfect. We have it in like a black. Yeah, like that. That looks ridiculous. I don't like it. <laughs> Me over here going, that's perfect. And then, no, I hate it. What do I mean? What if I made it a little bit shorter? It kind of looks like... I think this needs to come down. I can't tell. I can't tell. I don't know if I like that. This, I feel like, can be down here and then... It, it can still be the overhang, maybe? Or I really adjust this roofing so that it it hangs out. But see, I don't like that part. Let me just go all the way back to where I had it originally. Whoopsies. There we go. Uh, <laughs> screw it. I'm keeping it the way it was. I don't. I don't know. It just wasn't working for me. None of that was working for me. We could get the girder. I mean, I don't think this is absolutely necessary. Oh, I can't make it shorter though. Never mind. Eh. Eh. I keep trying to make it a little bit better. I think it's fine. We're gonna keep it the way it is. But now they have the solar panels, so I feel like the the compliance should be there for next time. Uh, auto lights, all lights, please. Uh, what else do I want to do for them? Like, I'm, I keep thinking I want to, like, upgrade the house a little bit more, but I guess we'll just leave it the way it is. Kyle just is going to work on his stuff here. How are, how are you doing? Oh, 12 days till you age up? <gasps> 11 days till you age up? <gasps> I might have them get married. <laughs> I might just start it. I kind of want her to get pregnant. I want her to have babies. I'm ready for her to have babies. Do you guys work today? You work in eight hours. You work in six hours. Okay. That's fine. Go to the bathroom. I think after work, they're going to go on a date. He's going to propose. I think that's what's going to happen. I think that's my plan. <gasps> Wait, do you need a shave? We gotta- we gotta look good. Shave your leg hair. And then you... You're doing- oops, that's not what I wanted. You're doing fine otherwise. I kind of want you to go back to sleep. Oh, you wanna kiss somebody? Wait. You wanna kiss somebody and volunteer as a family? Oh. Can you cuddle? Can I like force you to cuddle? Cuddle Kyle. Go on. Are you gonna wake up to cuddle? Why would you wake up to cuddle? Why would you do this? Are we broken? There we go. I just think it's so cute when they do this. Can I, like, fall asleep cuddling, though? Because I think... Yeah, go to sleep cuddling. There we go. Perfect. All right. Because they still need to get some more sleep, and it's, it's four in the morning. <laughs> I just love it when they cuddle. It's so cute. It is so cute. All right. Keep it going. Let them just kind of get some sleep in. Oh, okay. So, should I have her go to work today? I might have her go into work today. Kyle's going to go into work too. So they'll get home around the same time, which I think is good. Here, get some leftovers this morning. You both need to eat. 
And then I probably will have Kyle take care of himself. Ooh, where do I want to take them? Where do I want them to propose? I don't know yet. Suggestions. <laughs> I will take suggestions. Hmm. Maybe I'll go to the new world. Maybe we can go we can we can go somewhere over there. Oh, I like that they're just kinda hanging out together, having some pancakes. That's cute. Let's see. Off she goes to work. Did you have to do anything before work? Nah, you're good. And I'll take this. Kyle, you need to actually take care of yourself. And then you can go to work. Oh, I guess you, you're not going to go to work just yet. So, I mean, you could start a new painting. Do you want to start a new one? Let's try another figure painting. Dum, dum, da, dum, ba, da, dum, ba, dum. Cause what else do you need to do? Oh yes, you're actually on your next. Oh wait, we need to paint while inspired, and paint for five hours total. I love that he put his cowboy hat on. It's so cute. It's so cute. <laughs> he doesn't want to stumble. Is that what this one is? I always, I feel like I see this one a lot. I have so many clumsy Sims. It's super silly. Oh, wait, you need to get to work. Go on. Go on. Get to work. You're fully messed up for painting. I like, I actually like his uniform. I tend not to like their uniforms, but I feel like the uniforms for, for our Sims today are, are actually pretty good. All right, so they're going to be at work. She's going to be there for till three. Oh, do I have them? I need them working hard, too. Brian Lopez, it's good to hear your voice, Rose. This is one of our people that we were almost going to date. I wanted to ask you if I should get to know Elia Cruz. Do it. Do it. Uh, that's fine. Nice! Promotion! Okay, so this is good. We got a promotion. Promoted to warrant officer. Rose has been promoted to warrant officer. She will now make an additional 25 per hour for a grand total of 96 per hour. She's also received the following bonus. 1,130 simoleons, an eagle eye award, and new clothes. I like it. <gasps> is this your new outfit? Because you look adorable. I do love that one. Did you get, a, did you get another? You did! I love these medals. I love that we have a bunch of them. Here, let's put that over here. Yay! I love our little our, our accolades. Here, come admire them because I think that's actually kind of cute. I'm not gonna lie, that's kind of cute. So she's gonna be so excited about her promotion. She's gonna be like, I want to tell Kyle all about the promotion. Look what I got. Yay! So I'm gonna have her bathroom... Take a steamy shower. Admiring quality achievements. Yes! Oh, I like that. It's it's feeling her with a medium sense of, of uh, confidence. <laughs> At least it's something. Oh, wait, maybe should I have her work out? She needs to work out for work. I guess we could have her do a little bit of a workout and then take a shower. Because I think when Kyle gets home, he's probably going to need to take one too. So this is good, because she needs to get those muscles built up. Let's do this. Which, how are you doing? Let's see. We're at fitness level 7. I'm curious to see what her fitness level is. I guess we could always, like, cheat by going into cast and seeing where it is on, like, the bar, because that always helps. Okay, so Kyle should get home in, like, about an hour. I guess I should probably have her stop. What does he need to do when he gets back? Not much, actually. Nice! Made some money, came home from work. Here, why don't you use the bathroom? And then I'm gonna have you change quick. Let's see. Outfits. Oh! The suspenders are cute. 
that's your party outfit? No, that's your warm weather, I think. Actually, I think just this. Just like your just be really casual. I'm alright with that. And then he's gonna ask her out on a date. Can you order a ring? Is that a thing? Can we order one? Because I just like the idea of having a ring. You can purchase crystals. Oh, you know what? Get the sweetheart box, because that sounds actually, actually really cute. Donuts? <gasps> Talk chocolate truffles. Ooh, popcorn clusters! Uh, All of these sound so good. Here, get the strawberries. The chocolate strawberry sounds like a classic. It's perfect. Get that one. What else can we get? We can get a wedding cake. No, I'm not ready for the wedding cake yet. I was thinking... Hmm. Go to purchase gifts? I mean, I guess you could just buy a rose to, to give to her. Maybe that's romantic. A rose for your rose. That sounds very romantic to me. I'm doing it. You can't stop me. So he's going to get a rose for his rose, and then we're going to ask her out on a date. Once she's done with her shower. Oh, wait, no, don't eat yet, because I wanted you, him to come over here. And let's see. Asked to create a date. No, stop trying to eat. Oh, I like your outfit choice. I might put you in your rose outfit, though, because I think that'd be kind of cute. Yeah, we're going to go on a romantic... No, we can go... We can make it gold. That's fine. We're going to go on a romantic date. We want to be romantic. We Maybe, maybe we'll woohoo. A little bit of physical intimacy. Uh, let's see. Reminiscing? Maybe. <laughs> Potentially? Um, I feel like Kyle would play his guitar for her. Like, I, I now have this, this vivid feeling of getting him a guitar. <laughs> I don't know why, but I feel like we have to. Uh, maybe they can star cloud gaze. I think that's actually kind of cute. Maybe drinks and food. Maybe some dancing. Yeah, I think we'll go with that. And then, oh, where do we want to go? We could go to the bar. We could go to the Goldilocks bar. That could be a good spot for us to do it. <sighs> I might. Maybe I should just because I made it and it just feels right. And he's like, well, this is kind of like, you know, it, it's very us. I don't know why. I just feel like it should be. Otherwise, we could go over to Creek, Green Harbor, Chestnut Ridge. Where do we want to go? We could go here. They have a really cute park there. You know what? Maybe we'll just ma we'll make this a long... We're going to make this a long date. We're going to go to the bar first. I have plans. I have plans now in my head. <laughs> I think, at least. We'll see what happens. Come on. Loading screens are long. <laughs> okay. It's the happiest hour. Oh, perfect. We even got here at happy hour. Love that for us. What are you going to do? Oh, you're going to embrace each other. That's kind of cute. Come here and order some food. I guess you guys don't really want to order food yet, huh? You want to talk about woohoo and talk about dancing. So I suppose we could. Uh, let's see. What would that be under? 
I feel like talk about woohoo would be under the romance stuff, right? Apparently not. <laughs> oh, small talk. Here we go. That's what that is. It's small talk. Talk about carefree dancing and then maybe we can actually go do it. Why are you going into the road to talk to me? And then we can just woohoo in books. Honestly, yes. Because she likes to read, so maybe she's into some romanticy. You don't know. <laughs> Did I put a bench out here? Oh, I didn't put a bench. Blue, coming in with a scare. How's it going? Welcome on in. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna quickly throw down a bench because I want them to be able to look at the, you know, the sky. <laughs> but welcome, how are you doing? I hope you're having a great Thursday. Uh, bench. I'm surprised I didn't put a bench. I'm a little mad at myself now that I didn't put a bench in this one. I've already uploaded it. It is what it is. I guess we could put one of these guys. Oh, maybe that's actually kind of cute. No, I like that. I'm gonna put this here. I like that one. I might put a couple of these. I'll put another one on this side. That's really cute. Yeah, perfect. Lurking and playing Stardew? <gasps> I love it. Tell me about your farm. <laughs> I hope you're having a good time. And you're farming well. You remind me how much I like this game. I love The Sims. It's so easy for me to just get like caught up in it and get away from the world a little bit and enjoy The Sims. I love it. So I'm glad it helps you see, ah, oh, I like this game. <laughs> I feel like that means I'm having a good time. Oh, that's funny. How thought provoking. Kyle seemed to really enjoy that conversation. Could this mean that Kyle likes deep thoughts? Yeah, go for it, dude. You can like deep thoughts. I'm down for it. Oh, you meant Stardew. Oh. Well, I love Stardew, too. I have so much fun playing Stardew. I get so caught up in it. <laughs> I'm glad that works. Stardew is so much fun. Stardew is such a good game. And I feel like we're getting, like, super far into it. It makes me so excited. Aww. Yay. Aww. Look how cute they are. They're having such a cute time together. Sky gazing. Oh yeah, you gotta you gotta be super. Can you flirt while doing this? Here, let's see. Uh, tease for flirtatiously sounds like something he would one hundred percent do. And then, oh, I kind of want them to make out. Do it. Do it. <laughs> Oh, a give a vigorous massage. No, I want you to make out. I know it sounds really silly, but at the same time. Alright. Come on. You don't have to keep... They watch this guy for, like, forever. Aww. Yay. We're gonna have such a nice time. Okay, so they're they're making out. I'm gonna let them do their thing. Uh, <laughs> we don't have a place. Well, we do have a place where we could technically woohoo here, so m potentially do that. But let's grab some food. Let's grab some drinks. Let's see, you can order some. I was thinking French fries. Let's get some French fries. You're at D6 of winter. Oh, day six of winter, year one. Just found the second mind and you're on mine and you're on the other side of the big bridge. The one with the flying skulls. Oh, I love it. You got this. You've got this. <laughs> Bring some cheese with you. Oh, these two are flirting it up a storm here. I want you to grab a, a serving of the chips, too. Did you guys get your drinks? 
feel like they didn't get their drinks. Is that my drink? They stole my drink. <laughs> Here, order your favorite drinks again, because I don't think they, I don't, I either they didn't get them for us, or there we go. So that's hers. So you have your, oh wait, no, no, don't clean it up, don't clean it up, don't clean it up. Drink yours, and then he gets a, a dim and gusty. You know what? It feels about right to me. I like that. I like that a lot. Having a good time at the bar. You don't have a dairy yet? Oh, that's fair. What else could you have then? I'm trying to think of what, like, I guess like turnips? If you have turnips or just like some salmon berries, always a good one too. You know, you got a lot of stuff going on. You got sidetracked? You know what? That's okay. That's okay. Take your time. You don't need them right away. <laughs> So they have had their drinks. What time is it? It's 9.30. Here, be a little flirty. Oh, wait. No, you. You be flirty. Affection. Declare your love publicly. Do it. Do it. Oh, hi, Mom. Welcome on in. How are you doing? Oh, hi, Gracie. <laughs> Hi, Malicious Gracie. Welcome on in. How you doing? How's your Thursday going? How are you guys? I hope you're doing well. Oh, we'll go to the bathroom. Do you also have to use the bathroom? No, you need to take a nap. I, I guess take a nap. I didn't really want you to take a nap right now. Why did you guys... Everything, like, dropped so much all of a sudden with their needs i kind of you know what i'm gonna have them woohoo in the shower and then i might have them move to a new location there's also a ghost here <laughs> there's a few ghosts here oh here's another one here get out of here and then can we uh we not? I thought we could. Hold on. You know what? Screw it. Let's just move our date. I'm gonna move it. Let's we're gonna we're gonna change venue. Cause I have somewhere else for us to go. Mole's picking up Mc McDonald's for you. Nice. Enjoy. Enjoy some McDonald's. I like it. You're doing new job online training? Nice! Oh, that's fun. That's great. I hope it goes well. We're gonna go to the park here. I think that's the one I want to go to. Yeah, screw it. We're gonna go here. I think this is a good place. I don't know. We're, we're, if, if it's nice, then we're gonna stay. If it's not, we've moved venue again. It's fine. I like that we can move venue. It works out this, this for us, I think. <laughs> Oh yeah, this is a good spot because there's a little bar and everything still here too. Because what I was thinking... Oh, I didn't even realize these are shaped like hearts. No, that's so cute. Oh, they did a good job. They did a good job with that. Yeah, that's, that's great. Oh, there's like all these little statues around here. I haven't checked out this part. I really haven't. I kind of... Oh, I want them to be in a little private area. I think I'm going to have them come over here. Come over here and... Um, we're going to have a, a special moment, I think. I'm going to cheat. You don't see me doing it. I just want them to have a little bit of extra energy, okay? Leave me be. Let me do my... Let me have my fun. I hate that the, the trees disappear. Aw. See, we're having such a nice little time. Uh -huh. 
Ooh, wait, he got the chocolates? Let's do the chocolates. Uh, Not this. Where's my date? Is my date over? What happened with my date? Well, that was a date. It was a date, right? When did that end? Why did it end? You know what? I don't care. I don't care. We're pretending there's still a lot of date. I'm not dealing with it. I'm not dealing with it. Um, Romantic physical affection. There we go. Share the sweetheart box together. I think this will be really cute. I think it'll work. Come on. Whoa, okay. Apparently, he's dancing for her now? I don't know why. I, <laughs> I said to have the sweetheart box together. Wait, what is this? Friend balance slipping. Oh, that's okay. We'll, we'll figure it out. We'll get it. We'll get it to work. It's okay. Ooh, you're leveling up there, Kyle. This'll be cute. Aw, they're gonna have chocolate-covered strawberries. That sounds so good right now. I'm not gonna lie. Romantic, delicious. So cute. I like their- I like their- I actually do think they have a nice relationship going on, I'm not gonna lie. <sighs> I might do something crazy, though. Let's see if it lets me. I think we have to be a lot more romantic. Hold on. We might have to get into a specific mood for it to work. Give, a, give your rose. Because you got the chocolates. We're gonna give your rose. We're gonna we're gonna whisper sweet nothings and be super affectionate and maybe kiss and all of that good stuff. Oh I'm sorry, this is so cute. They're looking deeply into each other's eyes. Gave a rose. Come on, get why why won't they get like romantic here? Declare your love again? Why can't <laughs> Am I missing something? I'm confused. Make out in the great outdoors? What does that mean? Oh. Oh, he's a love bug. Be a love bug. Be a love bug, Kyle. We're gonna make out in the great outdoors. Caress her cheeks. Let's see. Dun, dun. I'm gonna do it. And we're gonna hopefully have it go through. Okay, guys, it's happening. Maybe if they're not too exhausted for it. Oh, or they're gonna kiss again. Not what I was expecting, but that's fine. Guys, guys. Um. <clears throat> <clears throat> I, uh, I, uh, um. <laughs> here it comes, here it comes, here it comes. Oh, he's nervous. Oh, he's nervous. Here it is. Yay! She said yes! Yay! Oh! Oh, I'm so happy. Now this feels right. They defeated the mother together. I was kind of worried she was going to say no because she's like tense right now from other stuff. But look, that worked out so well. How tender Kyle and Rose seem to care for each other, both as lovers and friends. Romantic partners with the wholesome romantic tr dynamic choose to perform romantic, friendly, or funny interactions with each other often. Oh, that's fine. I'm totally down for that. That's so cute! They're hot and heady, heavy. Attracted by an opposite? I didn't think you guys were like, opposites attract, but I mean, that's fine. Now you're engaged! So now, here's the thing. What do you guys think? Should we 
should we <laughs> elope immediately? Just elope immediately and get married right this second? Or should we have a wedding? I don't know if they would have a wedding is my thing, you know? I feel like they would just elope immediately. Now they're married. Like, because she's like such a paranoid sim. She's kind of like to herself type of thing. Kyle might be a bit more outgoing than she is. But I kind of like the idea of them just immediately eloping. <laughs> it's three in the morning. We're getting married. Screw it. Passionately kiss her. Should we have them dress up? Hold on. I'm going to have him put on his outfit. She's going to put on her outfit. We're getting married. <laughs> We're getting married. Uh, What's your fancy one? Oh, that's actually kind of perfect. It's got roses on it. Carrot! Hello! How are you? You don't have long, but you wanted to say hi and send all the love and hugs. It's good to see you! I'm sending it straight back because you're awesome. And it's good to see you. I hope you're having having a good time. Also, can't wait for the podcast. It's coming out soon! I'm behind, but it's coming out soon! <laughs> oh, I just realized they do have matching tattoos. Wait, that's super cute. That's super, super cute. Okay, ready? Elope immediately. It's happening. Your exhausted college is very busy. That's fair. That's very fair. All right, wait, wait, wait. There, the last name is Rivers, right? Because I, I have a feeling it's gonna go to Kyleson. I have no interest in being a Kyleson. We are Rivers. He's got the roses on his tie. It's so cute. This is like such a perfect spot. Aww. It's so sweet. I hope I'm doing well. Uh, that's all right. <laughs> all right, here it is. Saying their vows. Getting it in. I don't know what that was, but okay. Ah, I love it. I love them. I'm happy. You know what? She chose well. She made. She found the person that makes her the happiest, and I'm happy for her. Yay! We're married. Now they have to get home and sleep because it's just so. <laughs> There's so much happening right now. <laughs> oh, we are already married or moved in together, so I think we're fine. Thank you. Having their very first kiss, bull. No, they're not. What do you mean? Get out of here. I'm doing all right. I'm a little stressed out. <laughs> I, 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 it's fine. It's fine, though. You do have to go already. You finished assignments for tomorrow, but you're all, always thinking of me. Oh, thank you. I'm always thinking about you guys. It's kind of hard not to. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, have fun. Thanks. We're gonna have a good time. We're having a good time with our lovely, our lovely couple. It's gonna be good. It's good. Oh good, they did, they did leave her last name. I hope his name ends up being Rivers. That's what I wanted. I wanted him to be Kyle Rivers. <laughs> that was my plan. You know, you the best, Carrot. You the best. <laughs> but if you do have to get going, I'll see you later. Good luck with everything. I hope it goes well. And then I want you guys to woohoo. Should we have them try for a baby immediately? I kind of want to. I'm not going to lie. I kind of want to. We'll, ha we'll let them woohoo. They can have a day of not having pregnancy and, and babies yet.
I'm seeing you soon. Your brain needs to brain for assignment, so it should be interesting. Brain, you got this. Brain needs to brain, and brain can do it. I don't know what the hell I just said, but you know what? I hope it works. <laughs> Good luck. Have a great rest of your night. Oh my god, guys, just go to bed. Oh, you probably need to pee first, and then you can go to sleep. There we go. That's better. You appreciate the brain pep talk? Because brain hasn't been brain in. Brains can be mean. Brains can absolutely be mean to us. So I understand. Alright, do you guys both work today? Yeah, they do. They do, and they're both exhausted, so this kind of sucks. Aw, she got in there and cuddled him. I love it. It makes me happy. Bye! You take care, too! Bye! Oh. Uh, do we want to go in? You know what? I'm going to have you work from home, because then you can sleep a little bit more. Kyle, you're probably going to be uh, SOL um, and have to go in, so that's that's also okay. Go to work. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Go to work. Go to work. Go to work. You can have lunch there. He went in a little late, but I think that's okay. They are on cloud nine right now from getting married. You're, you're fine. You're fine. She's a little erratic, too. So I feel like both of those traits made her like, no, we're getting married right now. You propose. I want to just get married. So I feel like it worked out. It worked out well. All right, finish your food because I'm going to have you go for a jog. Look at those abs, though. Dang. Okay. <laughs> All right, get out there and have an energized jog. Oh, Kyle's getting a call. Oh, nope, I missed it. That's fine. And then they can watch a show when they get back tonight. I think that actually works really well. What does she want to do? Leave a note for someone. Oh, you want the family board. Can we fit the family board in? Because that would actually be kind of cute. I think we can. I think it would fit right on that wall. Is it just called the family board? This one. Yeah, that's actually kind of fun. I think we'll get it in the brown, because I feel like that one looks like it matches, and then they're just trying to... Oh, no, don't set curfew. You can't leave a note for Kyle. Oh. Isn't this the family bulletin board? I don't want set curfews. We'll set it for 11, I guess. She's practicing. I don't know. Whatever, it's fine. I thought you could leave notes on that, can't you? Isn't that the board? Bulletin board. Okay, hold on. Board. Yeah, that's the family bulletin board. All right, fine. Maybe you actually have to have kids for that to work, but I thought she would just be able to like have a note for Kyle for when he gets home, because I thought that would be kind of cute. Whatever. Read your, read your parenting book. Maybe read Avoiding the Watchful Eye. I think that would be kind of fun. You're going to take it easy today. Uh, so let's see. What else do I have to have you do? I mean, everything for work. You're good. You're good on work. I might have her go in tomorrow, though, so we'll see. Fourth Lieutenant Evidence Eraser. Interesting. Be married to your BFF. Oh. Well. <laughs> I guess we could become BFFs. I don't think that's a problem. Why are your hands broken? Here, try reading again. There you go. She can read. Do all of that. Maybe just like take care of herself. I guess she could like cook dinner too. Maybe a steamy shower. And then, oh, that still says lunch. Let me just have time go by a little bit. There we go. 
serve dinner fish and chips or fish tacos fish tacos <laughs> i'm thinking like a shrimp taco sounds really good oh they had a blast together that's nice i'm glad oh 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 because i've put the bookcase upstairs should i have one down here too I actually don't have a problem with that. I think it would be okay for them to have two bookcases. Even if it's like a small one. Let me see. We could get... Oh, maybe this one for the wall. What if we put this one on the wall? I don't know where, but somewhere it could fit. Oh, we could put it here. We could move our, our poster. And then maybe the lamp could come over here by the chair. I mean, it's not the best lamp anyways, so we could always get rid of that at some point, too. But I think that's actually pretty nice, having the bookshelf down here. Her hand's broken again. Oh, you got promoted! Promoted to art book cult. Oh, he looks so stressed out. <laughs> Co leader. Kyle has been promoted. He will now make an additional two per hour for a grand total of 23. Also made 422. Picture perfect art lighting, research art references on the computer. Very nicely done, friend. In fact, can we become best friends? Is that is that gonna be a thing for us? She's her hand is broken again. Here, you can join cooking. That's actually kind of cute. Why don't you guys cook together? Did she just pass out for no reason? What are you doing? Stop trying to sleep. You're not even that tired. You're acting like you're exhausted. Okay, hold on. I think it's her hand. My Sims... Oh, Jesus. Resume the fish tacos. Resume fish tacos. Stop eating pancakes. You're supposed to be eating fish tacos. The whole point was that you're going to make fish tacos together. Put that... No, put here. Put this one away. She's not acting like she can't cook. Can you clean it up? Alright, she cleaned it. Stop eating the pancakes! <laughs> All right, when my game gets like glitchy like this, it drives me nuts. Come here and take a steamy shower. Stop eating the damn pancakes. No, you're not going to bed. No, because now I'm pissed off that all you wanted to do was sleep for no reason. When it was like in the yellow, you shouldn't be like trying to sleep that whole time. Get in here and make the damn fish tacos. Thank you. <laughs> Sims is great like that. Yeah, there's... there's whew, I don't get it. Sometimes they just get really silly and then I have to reset them every two seconds. I'm like, why? Why? I shouldn't have to do this. It's okay. It's okay. She's gonna make them some fish tacos. They're gonna have a good time. Stop eating freaking pancakes. No. No. Uh, why don't you just come here? Game of llamas. Oh, I like it. Sit down for a second while she cooks. Yeah, do you smell that? Smells delicious. Grab a serving. You can also grab a serving. I want you both to sit here. And then I was going to have you guys watch the premiere now. Because it is premiere day. You may as well watch the premiere and enjoy your tacos. I think that's perfect. There we go. The game of llamas. Looks like the mummy. <laughs> okay, so they're gonna watch that. I'll, I'll put this away. Don't worry, Kyle. I'll clean up after you. I know you're a smidge lazy. It's it's fine. Wait, now it turned into a 
an ER type show? What is this? No, you gotta watch the game. What? Aren't you guys? What? <laughs> it's acting like they're not watching the premiere, but I thought. It's like taking them forever to watch the premiere. Okay, so I guess they did it. <laughs> oh, sometimes it's a little awkward. It's fine. Here, go to the bathroom. I guess technically you're supposed to do this while inspired, but why don't you resume your figure painting until she's done also watching the premiere? Because then... Then... Oh, should we be silly? I kind of want them to be a little silly. Hold on. <laughs> I can't help myself. I, I, I want to be able to try some of the new stuff. Let's see. I guess this can just sit outside for now. We'll put it in this corner. And then... The trunk. Where is it? This one. We may as well have a bit of fun. And you can... We can both wear flirty costumes. <gasps> fantasy wait should we go random should we go with like a random costume i'm thinking flirty come here and call come wear a random costume i want to see what they end up putting on i think it'd be funny really you decided to put on like kiss the cook that's actually kind of fun. I like it. What did you end up putting on? Just a mask? That's it? Just your same outfit, but like a mask? <laughs> I thought you were going to do something like more than that. Here, try something else. Here, go random. <laughs> now she's the ranch hand. All right, the ranch hand and the cook are about to... <laughs> we're about to churn some butter. Churn some butter. I think it's just... um, It's necessary to churn some butter. In um, their fun costumes. Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Oh, they changed! Oh, come on! You were supposed to churn butter. It's okay. <laughs> what is this? Oh, creative fog! As his creative muscles are stretched thin. Oh, he wants to, like, do some exercises and stuff. That's fine. You could be physical. I mean, we're being physical right now. I feel like it counts. Ooh! Now they're level five. I guess I should see what, like, that changes in their... in their abilities. But I'm okay with this. Okay, they're kind of exhausted, though. I probably should just have them sleep now. Fireworks are going off. Oh, do you need a shower first? Here, you come down here and shower. Or I guess sleep and then we can we can deal with a shower later. Or, you know what? Just keep going back and forth. That's also fine. It's also fine. <laughs> Cold shower, get back to bed. At least they're completely satisfied, you know? I'm... Um, Proud of them for being able to do that. And it was a success TV season, so we love that. Did I change the... Oh, good, I did. Okay, so I did change it. I don't know if I told you guys this last time or if we did that last time, but I did want the seasons to be a little bit longer. I just haven't added in all of the holidays yet. I guess we should do that, technically speaking, but I think we're okay for now. I just like having longer seasons. I feel like it it adds to to everything a little bit more. But I guess with like normal lifespan, it might be too long, so we'll have to see. You might as well continue. I'm gonna have her go into work today. Oh, I hit work from home like an idiot. I wanted you to go into work today. I didn't want you to work from home. Oh, 
it's fine. It's fine. She can go to work tomorrow. I just feel like they their stuff goes up a lot faster when they actually work. They go into work, you know? Oh, she's creating a drawing. Aw. Put a little drawing up on the board. Oh, there you go. Now you can write the note for Kyle. Here, do that. Fine. You just like create a drawing for somebody too. It's kind of funny. All right, go here. Yeah, I know. Me misclicking on everything, but it should be all right. I'm not too. I'm not too concerned. Let's see. What else do we need to do for us, Kyle? You probably should get up because you're gonna be working soon. It's like a to-do note. It's like, here's your things that you needed to do today. Thanks. Bye. <laughs> she just runs off. Oh, why do you have relationship fears? You can flirt with yourself. That's fine. Here, come flirt with yourself. <laughs> Kyle has to go to work soon. So he I have him just painting away because he needs to start that first. I will need her to go run on a treadmill, so we might just go back and run at our our new place across the way. Because it's like right across the street. It's perfect. It doesn't say she has to run on a treadmill at a gym. So I think we'll go over to the one we built and run there. That's why I built it in the first place. He has to go to work. You know what? We'll just head out now. I think that's fine works for me. Do, do, do. Go over here to the Goldilocks Saloon. Or the Goldilocks Zone, since it's more than a saloon. Da, 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 ba, da, da, da. Straight to the gym. Ooh, a hill challenge. Do a hill challenge. <laughs> that sounds fun. We probably should turn this on because it's going to get hot in here otherwise. There we go. Oh, you could watch TV while uh, you work out. You want to watch a movie? <laughs> I think you can I, I you should be able to watch TV while you work out. I think it's like in a good spot. Or oh, she's just not interested. That's okay too. That's fine. Okay, Kyle's off to work, so I'm going to have him work hard. Rose is doing her running. And I might just have her do a few different workouts today. What what was the ones that I have to work on? I always I keep forgetting cuz I'm like I have to try to to remember. Oh yeah, fitness, logic, and parenting. So we should probably do some logic stuff too. Because our logic is at level six. That's actually not too bad. I'm I'm good with that. And I was thinking she should do some more programming just as like a little side gig. So might have her do some programming and some like logic wow. stuff. And then uh, can, she can keep working on her parenting stuff too, I guess. Like with just reading her book until she actually ends up having a baby. I think that's fair. Okay. Oh, you put this over on this side. There we go. But that's all she has to do for work. She has like the easiest assignments from home for work. <laughs> I swear. Uh, should we push the limits? I feel like we should push the limits. Here, do some boxing. Uchima. What is Judith Ward doing here? Go away, Judith. <laughs> yeah, get it. We'll probably work out until... I'll have her stay here till 11 and then I'll have her go home. She, of course, wants to have a drink. I'm gonna say no to the drink for now. Uh, just because it's like, you know, the middle of the day. I know we came to a saloon, but technically we came here for the gym, so. 
I think that's fair. All right, here, go home. And we can go work on some of our programming and logic skill. Oh, I'm like tired. <laughs> I do, I do love this though. I love this like little story that we have going and they're gonna start their family and see what happens. Noki Doki, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. We hit our follower goal. <laughs> but welcome. Thank you so much. How are you doing today? Oh, there we go. Have some food. That's fine. Eat, eat your food. Do your thing. We'll see what we can do here. You too go to a saloon for the gym. You know, sometimes. Sometimes it's just the best spot to, to work out. <laughs> Sometimes it's just the best place to find, right? I mean, if I could make this a multifunctional place, I would have. So it has their saloon, it has the gym, and all of that good stuff. But it's all right. <laughs> Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> oh, I love that you did the moly moly. You love washing your food dishes in the bathroom sink too. Oh, it's like the it's the best thing. You know, sometimes you gotta wash your dishes in a bathroom sink and I don't know what that sound was. I'm just going to ignore it. Everything's fine. She she's fine with just washing her dishes in the kitchen though, so luckily we're good there. Um can I do logic on here? Because I don't think logic will do anything when I do my programming. Here, continue making your plugin. You might as well. I forgot you were working on a plugin a long time ago. I'm trying to think of what else she can do on here that would help with logic. Because how did I get logic up so quickly? What was I doing? <laughs> was I just doing this stuff for, like, making the potions and everything? Potions. The... I think it was. I think it was just when I was working on all the science equipment. That was probably all I had to do. <laughs> yeah, this is the Strangerville world. So we're living in Strangerville. We're doing uh, the Secret Garden Legacy. This is Gen 1. And it has everything to do with the Strangerville world and all of that kind of stuff. So it's really fun. Also, hello. Yes, hello. <laughs> but we are, we are living currently in... Uh, in our well, it's a bigger trailer now. It was a small trailer. Um, we have recently renovated so that we have a bigger trailer happening here. It's huge. It actually looks way too big, but eh, screw it. This works for now until we end up getting a house. <laughs> but you know what? We are the Strangerville heroes, so I think we deserve to have a bigger place. That's one of the last words you don't have. You kind of wish you did. It is a really fun world. Honestly, I like the story and everything. It's very cute. There's some good stuff going on. It's small. I wish it was bigger and had more lots, you know? That's kind of the downside. But otherwise, it is like a really cute world. How do I like the legacy so far? I'm having a blast. I'm already having a blast with it. <laughs> I like the Strangerville stories. So I was like, oh, this is fun to start off with. It has me like hooked. <laughs> Wait, did you... Why? Didn't I... Did you finish it? Did, did, did you finish it? Oh, you did. Alright. Did you get anything for it? 11 from sale proceeds. Nice. Nice. I like that. Well, you're getting mis mischief. I don't really want mischief. What else can we do, though, for logic? I guess we could get you a chess table. I think that's fair. Where are you? Which one do I want? There's like there's a few different chess tables. Hold on, let me see. Chess. Uh, maybe just the maybe just this one. We could put it upstairs. Oh, there's not that much space. Oh, duh. We we could observe the sky. That's what we could do. I think that's even better, honestly. We'll do that instead. 
You love the lore? It gives you old Sims vibes? It does! That's the best part! I love, like, the old, the old school vibes on the Sims. It makes me excited and happy. <laughs> It's, it's like Stranger... This is Strangerville. It's like Strange Town. A little bit different, you know. But it still works. Let me get some of that logic going. Oh. Yes, Father Winter? What can I do for you? I have a crush on Allison Aguirre. <laughs> what? I mean, you know what? Screw it. Love is in the air. I just got married... I think it's fun. I didn't get married. She got married. Rose just got married. <laughs> I've been married. Uh, we may as well say yes. Enjoy some love there, Father Winter. And we still need to become best friends with Kyle. I guess we might as well do that when he gets home. What time do you get home? Five? That works. That works. Uh, change your passwords because you're paranoid that somebody may have hacked you. I understand that feeling. And then let's make another, let's make another plugin. I feel like you like making plugins. I don't know if you can work out again yet or very soon. Let me see. Oh yeah, we could push to the limits. Epic workout after that. Epic workout, I say. <laughs> You just got love struck and you love it for some reason. Love struck is kind of fun. It's it's so chaotic in such a old Sims way. The chaos of it, the raunchiness of it. <laughs> I get it. I get it. I I feel that. Say yes to the dress. Say yes always. Always to the dress frost every time. I mean, I got not every time. When you feel it's right, then say yes. <laughs> oh, nice. You got promoted again? Kyle, you're doing so good. I'm so proud of you. I saw what you did last week. I was there. I saw everything. Who is this? <laughs> Who is this? You just got pranked. Mm, noxious. She made 40 bucks off of her new plugin. And you are making a, now an additional three hours, three simoleons per hour as a hungry artist. You got 464 simoleons and you can study the human form. I like it. I like it. You're doing so good. You're living your passion. That's what needs to happen here. Very nice. Uh, let's see. How do we become best friends? Oh, he comes in here and immediately just starts making out with his wife. Love that. Where... Is it just under relationship? I can never find anything anymore. Oh, here we go. Become best friends. Do it. I want to become best friends. We're married. We're best friends. No? He... Okay. You can see it on the screen right now. He is a love bug because he just became a love bug, but he's very flirty. I don't feel very flirty. No, what do you mean? What, where in any of that does it make any sense for him to become unflirty? Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Uh, it's fine. <laughs> Oh, you have to do more dates? I want to do more dates. I guess we could. I guess we could do more dates. I just thought it would be kind of nice for her to find her soulmate. And then start wanting to do, like, the family tree stuff. But it's cool. Like, I'm thinking super parent. Or, like, successful lineage. You are going to end up with four kids with this one. So any of those are probably possible. Here, share, share some brilliant ideas. Frickajene is is right. That is right. Kyle, do you have any friends yet? Oh, you know some people. That's good. You know a ghost. It's great. You have no co-workers. I'm actually kind of surprised you don't have any co-workers, though. Okay. 
Oh, is she, like, tired? Yeah, that's fine. You can take a nap. Kyle's got some stuff that he needs to work on. Oh, he wants to watch a movie. And host a perfect date. We will do that. You can be the host of a perfect date, I promise. But for now, let's work on some of your art... Art skills. Oh, you need to be inspired, not flirty. Thoughtful shower? Is that gonna be enough? He's so flirty right now. I don't know if it's going to be enough. Becca can come over. I like that they just have friends that like to stop by and, and hang out. Oh, this is your, um... This is her workout buddy. I forgot about that. You want to talk about Strangerville? And just be like, yeah, I'm the Strangerville hero. That's right. I just got married, you know, having a good time. You'll wonder if they'll reopen the sciences facility in the crater. Surely nothing could c bad could come of it. I mean, I suppose they could now, like, actually. <laughs> I could kind of see that happening. Stop trying to be flirty. Bright and day. I kind of want you to do another epic workout. I think that would be... That would probably be a good idea. If Becca wants to join you, I think that would be fine. Aw, I love that we have, like, so many friends and stuff. She knows a lot of people. And it's all because of the Strangerville mystery, honestly. Look at this. So many people! Poor Kyle has no friends. I probably should have Kyle meet some of her friends. <laughs> and see if, see if they, uh, they vibe together. You know what, speaking of... You can eat your taco, that's okay. But you might as well introduce yourself to Becca and say hi. Let's see. Oh yeah, they got good compatibility. Okay, they could be good friends. I like it. Her legs. Dang. I love it. You got some muscular legs. No, he's burnt out. <laughs> no, you can't be burned out. He'll recover over time, but take breaks and relaxing will help speed up recovery. Oh my god, why did you have to get burned out? I didn't even see it. Well, that sucks. <laughs> that sucks. He has a fear of failure, and now he's burned out. Great. I forgot he lived in a haunted house at some point. He survived seven nights in a haunted house. He could become a paranormal investigator. Could be kind of fun. It happens too often. It really does. I feel like they're doing super well in their career, and then all of a sudden they're like, no, I'm burnt out. But honestly, IRL, yeah, you're right. IRL too. You're, you're doing something you love, and then all of a sudden you're just like, I can't do it. I can't do it anymore. <laughs> Or you're just, like, working and you're just like, I can't. Ah, uh, it's too much. <laughs> I feel it. I feel it. Put that there. What are you doing? Oh, he's... Oh, yeah, you're feeling inspired. You know what? Go for it. Autonomously art. Because you want to and not because you have to. That's the way it should be. And then we'll have you take a shower, and then I might have you do a little moon gazing before bed. Just so that we can try to get your logic skill up, because we have to get the logic skill up, and we are currently at six. I mean, that's actually not too bad. We're only at, we're at six. We're still a young adult right now. So I, we're in like no true rush. But this is, this is good. And she's feeling super focused. So honestly, taking a, a good shower should help her. Oh, well now she's energized. Whatever. I thought she was going to say super focused, but that's, that's fine. <laughs> that's fine. Uh, let's see. Oh, good. Okay, so that did count. So now we have to achieve level four painting skills, sell three paintings to an art gallery, and get some emotional paintings going. That's fine. That works. A little at a time. I mean, you don't have to work for 
like an actual art company <laughs> per se, Kyle. You could quit your job and just be an artist. I would be okay with that. I would be okay with that. You're going to make a lot of money off of your art eventually. I'm not going to be too worried about it. Just don't find a meteor. That's like the last thing we need is you to find a meteor right now, okay? <laughs> uh, we'll, we'll do this. Well, maybe till one in the morning? I don't want to be here too long. Because she does need to sleep, and I think you do work in the morning, too. Oh, you don't! Oh, good. She doesn't work in the morning, so she can stay up and, and, <laughs> and gaze at the moon for a little bit longer, I suppose. Aww. The cuddles. Every time, it just makes me happy. I do need- we probably should check, cause... I was hopeful for a baby soon, and I don't think she was pregnant, so I might have them do a little bit of woohoo in this morning, and then we'll see what happens from there. Hi Jess, welcome on in! How are you doing today? Welcome, welcome! I hope you're having a fantastic Thursday. Okay, you both can get up. You both can get up. I'm just gonna go for a little try for a baby. We tried for a baby before. They're satisfying. So they're gonna try for a baby again. <laughs> and hopefully it takes this time. Oh man. Get on in there. And hopefully that helps with his burnout too, honestly. He's got six hours of burnout to deal with. So they can go for that. She needs to eat. I love just being able to hear it muffled in the background. I guess you could probably eat too. That's fine. Yeah, that works for me. A very satisfying woohoo this morning. Very good. Yeah, you could just just go down. I know it's like awkward to have to climb a ladder when you have to pee, but <laughs> do what you gotta do, bud. Do what you gotta do. Oh, congratulations on the big promotion at work. You deserve it. Thank you. Do I know you? I do a little bit. You're not like a a buddy. I probably need to work on my relationships. Jess is my best friend. <gasps> Did she have the baby yet? Invite Jess over. I want to see if she had the baby. Because if we have the baby around the same time, they could be they could be little friends. Oh, she did have the baby! <laughs> Maybe we should go to her house. We could go to her house and, and, and see the new baby. I'm surprised they didn't have her call me and um and see the new baby. Because usually when you're friends with people and they just had a baby, they'll do that. I'm going to have her take a pregnancy test. I want her to be pregnant. Let's go. No, um, Jess, Jess, I know you're trying to make yourself feel better, but look, I got to, I got to, I got to check right here. Anytime. Anytime. Should he miss work? Yeah, I think he has to miss work for this momentous occasion. Please miss work for this because we're eating for two! She's pregnant! Yay! Oh, I'm so excited. Look at her belly. Look at her belly. You didn't appreciate the mayor releasing the fish from the frozen lake competition? Did you want to take them home? I mean, sometimes it's like, oh, I got a really good fish. <laughs> I want to take them home. Look at the baby, Kyle. We're pregnant! We're gonna have a baby! It's the first one. The first of four. The first of many. Unless it's like twins or triplets. You know, I didn't really think about twins or triplets. I'm hoping it's just one. Hoping it's just one. I'm not gonna lie. I, uh, concerned. Go ahead, experiencing burnout. 
you know, go ahead, go to go to work, but I'm gonna have you just contemplate the art while you're there. I'm actually thinking these two should go to her house because I want to meet the baby. I want to see what they named the baby. I'm curious. <laughs> you got two midnight carp. My my husband and I were playing last night. We played a little Stardew together. There's the baby, and uh, we also did the the ice fishing competition. And I got a midnight carp. I'm like, why are there midnight? They put they put stuff in the lake, right? It says that they 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 supplied it with extra fish so that we could have the competition. I'm like, you put midnight carp in there. I'm like, can I keep it? And now you're doing the same. I love that you're like, can I keep it? <laughs> You're not a farmer anymore, you're a fisher. You're literally keeping yourself up by selling fish. It's my favorite thing to do, honestly. I love to fish. I realize now that your friend is probably still at our house. Yeah, she is. Here, um, invite to come over to her own home. But I want to see the baby. Oh. Oh, you're an infant. Okay. Let me meet the infant. Where are you going? Where, 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 where? No, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> Just have Christy. Christy's their other daughter. Christy can have you uh, meet the baby. I think that's fair enough. <laughs> Unless you don't even know her. You probably don't, because I mean, you knew her when she was a kid. Now she's a teenager. Do you even know Dylan? You probably don't. We're just like, we we know we know Jess. Jess is my best friend. I came to meet the baby. Jess is at my house, and I just came here to meet the baby on my own. Aww. Yeah, I want their families to be close. I think that's actually kind of cute. Cuddle. Play peekaboo. Comfort. Aw, Mara? Is that the name? Mara. Mara Sigworth. <laughs> she just falls over. I like it. Oh, now you're just going to do tummy time. Immediately does some tummy time. That's so cute. I like that it's just her going, I just want to meet the baby of my bestie. I mean, you should probably go home and read some more parenting books because um, currently we're only at level one. So I think once we actually have the babies, it'll be better. Yeah, tell me time next to the pile of garbage. That's a good point. That's a very good point. Should we help clean it up for them? Oh, you're watching a show. Every time I hear that that sound, I'm like, where? Why is there like the cavalry coming with like the horn? Why are you feeling paranoid? What are they talking about? <laughs> She's like, I'm feeling real paranoid right now. Well, here, why don't you hand the baby over? Oh, or put the baby on the ground. That's fine. And you can go home, and we can work on our, our own skills. You're feeling very romantic, so I think it makes sense. I liked that. You know, just a little meeting. I wanted to see the new baby and see what they named it. <laughs> it makes sense. I like that they do just live right down the street. But I, I'm like, do I want to become full-on neighbors, right, and live in the house next door? Or do I want to go to the top of the hill? And I kind of feel like going to the top of the hill would be really fun. And we can build, like, a basement up there and everything. I think that would make sense. All right, get the mail. Did, was there just... Oh! Thank you for saving... <gasps> Thank you for saving Strangerville from that terrible infection. Here's a small token of thanks. Open your fan mail. What you get? All right, we got a future cube. And here's another one. Open fan mail. A fish. A tetra fish. <laughs> Wait, that's fun. It's addressed to Strangerville hero. <laughs> 
No, I love that. I love that. Should we get a fish tank for the fish? That's all. I mean, it's very silly. I, I kind of like that it's just like these very goofy things that they're giving us. Maybe this aquarium is better. Or we can just get the little one. Can it go on like that shelf? I kind of want it on that shelf. We'll put it in here. This is fine. Here, add fish. We'll add our tetra. There we go. Should we name it? Should we name it something? You thought it would be like a statue or something? We do have um, this statue that we got, um, which is like a piece of the mother plant cut in half. I think it's really cool. I put it on top of the house. So now we kind of have like this really fancy ornament on top of our house there. <laughs> I said we should have gotten like more money and stuff, but I mean, if they're just, it's just fan mail, you know? So getting a fish in a future cube kind of, um, kind of makes sense. It kind of makes sense. Here, should we ask it a question? Ask about... Ask about, let's see, ask a question. I have no idea what we're asking. Huh. That was fun, do it again. Nah. <laughs> Where did you just set that down? Why would you, why would you set it down on the back of the toilet? Why? Here, ask about the future. And maybe ask about some scientific mysteries. So this is about the future. The future is soon. <laughs> TM. <laughs> the mysteries of the universe shall be revealed with study. All right, that's fine. That's that's cool. <laughs> oh, Kyle's home. Kyle's home. Should I go poop? Ask again later. <laughs> That's fair. Sometimes you just gotta... Why would I congratulate him on our marriage? But sometimes you just gotta ask before you go you go to the bathroom. You're just like, is this is this something I need to do necessarily right now? Or am I good? Aww. Aww, was that a whim? Oh, Wait, that's kind of cute. Say so you look absolutely gorgeous. I want, I want him to... Let's see. Oh, ask to wear a flirty costume. I mean, we could. <laughs> we could if they're feeling up for that. Let's see. She isn't like mo like motion sick. She isn't getting uh, morning sickness right now. So maybe that would probably be a, a silly thing for them to do. Yeah, screw it. Ask to wear a flirty costume. Let's go. <laughs> what do you mean? Can't you climb up the, the ladder? Oh wait, no, she can. Okay, good. I was like, you're acting like you don't know how to how to do that. All right, what are you gonna put on? I was not expecting that, um, at all. This is your flirty costume? Where are you hiding the baby? <laughs> what? <laughs> I was not expecting you to become a skeleton. She's dancing for him. What am I looking at right now? They got skeletons in the closet! <laughs> no, wait, no, have him put on one. What is his costume going to be? Hold on, because this is amazing. This is amazing. All right, Kyle, your turn. Here we go. Putting on our, our flirty costume. Kyle, your choice. The robot and a skeleton. This feels like there should be a punchline, and I don't know what it is, but a robot and a skeleton put on some romantic, you know, some flirty costumes. 
Know. You guys can put, uh, you know what, just insert punchline here. I don't know what I'm looking at right now. <laughs> Okay, hold on, because the fun part is when they put on the costumes is they have different they have different woohoo things. So the saying for this one is oil joints with Rose and yours is to shake bones. Oh no, you guys gotta shake some bones. We're shaking bones together. Let's go. I didn't know the skeleton was one of the costumes. There's so many costumes. We should explore these one day. I have to explore all of the outfits because this is ridiculous. Let's make a skeleton key together. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> Oiling up some joy. No, you got to keep the costumes on. Why did they take them off? Aw. It's way more fun with them on, I gotta say. I gotta say. So there's some playful costumes. We got some fantasy ones. A gnome, Father Winter, Fairy, Darth Vader, Darth Maul, Boba Fett, Boba Fett, whatever. Alien, Isla Sakura, Robot, Princess Leia, Pirate Ninja, Mask, Luke Skywalker, a Knight, and the Grim Reaper, a Witch, a Victorian, a Spartan, a Space Ranger, a Smuggler, and a Skeleton. The Skeleton literally is one. Then there's a bunch of different jobs. Maid, luchador, firefighter, doctor, clown, cheerleader, butler, astronaut, villain, ranch hand, police, pizza delivery, park ranger, mail carrier. Holy cow. And then there's whimsy. A panda, mascot, hot dog, flower bunny, eggplant, catfish, bear, apron, raccoon, and a peach. There are a ton of costumes. I like that. I like it just like... Do it at random, because I want to see at random what they choose, because I think it's way more fun that way. But it's so silly. It's so silly. Now he's just wearing his silky pajamas. You know, nice and comfy. Nice and comfy cozy. Grebo! You're fine. Just, um, you know, get down that ladder as a pregnant lady who needs to pee. That sounds like a fantastic thing to need. Oof. Oof is right. All right, honestly though, we do need to start thinking of some baby names, all right? So this is Kyle Kyleson. This is Rose Rivers. This is the Secret Garden Legacy Challenge. So I'm kind of thinking, you know, nature names probably would probably be the best. Um, next gen, I guess we could look at that. The next generation is the sunflower generation. It is yellow. So if any of that sparks like, Thoughts on names? We're going to have to get some names. There's going to be four babies. So I'm going to need a lot of names. <laughs> I'm going to need a lot of name suggestions. Because right now we are in... Second trimester? No, we're in the first trimester. We have the second trimesters in uh, 12 hours. <gasps> Sunny. Wait, Sunny is a, such a cute name. All right, I gotta write these down so we don't forget. I guess I should probably make like a OneNote or a um or an Excel sheet for this. I'll do a OneNote because it's easier. This is for my secret garden legacy. This is the names list. Sunny's perfect. I love Sunny. Sunny is a perfect name. <laughs> that is such a good name. But if anybody else has any suggestions, let me know. Like I said, second gen is Sunflower Yellow. So probably all of them will wear some sort of yellow outfit and have some sort of theme there. And then we'll choose from all four of them who gets to actually be the heir. Are you going to go right back to sleep? That's fine. You can go right back to sleep. I think Kyle's in bed, so feel free. Get to bed. What do you have to do for work? I'm hoping we're not going to have any issues. This is why I'm going to have her go into work now so that they can, so that she can actually do her stuff for work um, without having any issues. Oh, 
brain block. Kyle's burnt out. Oh, no. And it became a total brain block. It seriously is going to impact everything. Why? Uh, <sighs> All right, I'm going to have to have him take off for work and stuff. He's going to take off for the day. He's going to relax. I'm going to have him work out and just kind of do his thing and not worry about work too much. Because that just sucks. Oh, my gosh. Oh, it would be really cute, too, if Sunny ends up getting, like, the blonde hair from, from Kyle. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. If any of them ends up being the blonde, we might have to go with it because it's yellow. <laughs> okay, you're taking a shower. I, You know what I should look up? I kind of want to see. Can we order like a onesie and stuff? Where is Plopsy? Browse Plopsy. Oh, look at the bear. Do you guys want to get a Agnes Crumplebottom cross stitch? <laughs> uh, so there's no onesies right now on sale. I was hopeful. I was hopeful for a onesie. What is she doing? She's creating a new drawing. I sh I guess you should read your note for you. Was there any notes for you? Doesn't look like it. Actually, there's a few notes on the board, though. I mean, I guess if you're going to get up to 2 in the morning, you might as well do some moon gazing, right? Get some moon gazing in there. is good. Kyle, why are you awake? I need you to relax and do your thing. <laughs> nice note. Aw, those notes were so sweet. Oh, good. I'm glad he enjoys the notes. That's that's good. I guess you could look at the drawing, too. Here, we will take a nice steamy shower. Oh, I guess I should have had them, like, run first. But I'm probably just going to have them go to bed. So that they can relax and sleep in a little bit. Can she still get hit by a meteor pregnant? Because, like, pregnant sims I don't think can die in the game. But now I'm, like, curious if she can still get hit by a meteor? Why aren't you sleeping? Go to sleep. You have, you're going to be in your second trimester in three hours or five hours or whatever that said because I wasn't really paying attention. Now it's three hours. <laughs> now it is. He's feeling like he wants to draw and stuff. And I'm like, but I'm, I'm afraid to have him actually draw. Here, why don't you put on... Listen to... Do you have a favorite? Do you have like your favorite music? Let me see. It doesn't look like he has any favorite music. Because these are all like your hobbies, deep thoughts, optimistic. Yeah, so you don't you don't actually have a favorite song. So let's put on some like classical music and then go for a jog. Because I'm hoping I'm hoping that's going to help his his brain fog. His awful brain block. It'll just get him moving a little bit. Can't you do... Here, just... Do you... Yeah, you should still be listening. Okay, perfect. You're sleeping. You probably should get up and actually take care of yourself, too. Do you work today? No. Okay, good. Because then I can at least get you to kind of do your other stuff first. Get some leftovers. I don't know... Okay, we can still spar. Oh, she could still work out? I didn't think they. I didn't think she could. No, that's good. Cause then I can just like have her do a nice workout too. I'll do an epic workout this morning after she eats, and then <laughs> and then maybe either some programming. We could do some. I don't. I guess she could still like observe the sky. Oh, you know what? Read a read, parenting book. Is that a- did this say reread? Maybe I need to get a new book. Purchase books. Uh, is it under skill? It's probably under skill, right? Parenting. There it is. Okay, you might as well grab both of the books. Get them both. Get them out here. 
open this up. We'll see if you can read parenting level two. I think so. Because I think you're still only like, yeah, you're only at level one. So I don't know if level two. Yeah, wait a minute. No, I'm, I'm lying. I'm lying. Read book one again. <laughs> Read book one one more time just to make sure you understand everything it said to you. Because you were reading that before you were even thinking about a baby. Let's go! <laughs> Let's go, Rose! Epic workout! He wants to watch a movie. Honestly, that's probably a good idea. You can come home and watch a movie. Whatever you'd like to watch, go enjoy that, Kyle. I don't know if you have to still be listening to music, though, at the same time. Let's turn that off. Nice! It's going down. This is good. Are you watching, like, a sad movie? I don't know if I can watch this one. <laughs> Is it like Homeward Bound or is it like Marley and Me? Because those are two different sad stories with very uh, different outcomes. Okay, she's enjoying, she's actually enjoying her workout. I don't want to make her stop so she can read instead. So I'm going to let her just continue on. Except I think an epic workout takes forever. Yeah, it's, go it's going on for a long time. I feel like this is more of a homeward bound situation because they're going on like little adventures. Why does it always end? Like they turn it off right at the end of the movie. <sighs> I mean, if you really want to upgrade something, I suppose I could have you tinker away, but I don't know what we could have you tinker away at. Oh, is it time? My lights turned off. <laughs> They, they tend to tell me when I'm done streaming. Okay. Get to read your little parenting book. I was hopeful that she would have the baby first. But I mean, that is going to be in a couple of days. Ah, screw it. We could probably keep going until she has the baby. I'm all right with that. We'll do that. We'll do with the next couple of days and, uh and see what happens. Cause hopefully we can get Kyle's brain block gone. Where are we at with that? Five hours? Cause it is a creative burnout. So I don't think doing anything creative is going to be helpful. So I'm gonna just have him do like some workouts, watch movies. Maybe we could have him play a video game or two. I guess now he's no longer lazy. We can be, that's fine, be active. Screw it. <laughs> be active. He's at least enjoying being active. I kind of like how much he struggles and she's like doing epic workouts and he's just struggling in the background right now. <laughs> oh, what just happened? Oh, self-discovery moment. I was like, why did it why did it jump to Kyle? Is he about to die? Self-discovery. Immediately amazing and working out. Let's go. Alright, let's see. Can you can you use the restroom while you while you do that? That should be good. Hi Jared, what's up? Wanna let you know that Angela and I are now dating. Oh, do I know Angela? I know Jared. And at one point we were like flirting with him and then we fought him. I don't think I know you're Angela. That's fine. Enjoy your relationship. I love that for you. That's so great. Okay, she's going to the bathroom though and then going back to reading. I kind of want Kyle to touch their belly because it's just too cute. It's going to be so cute. Oh, see, that's really helping. It's really helping him, like, get that brain fog to go away by working out. Maybe I should just have him, like, jog every morning instead of just, like, constantly painting. He jogs in the morning, then goes to work, then comes back, does some painting. That might be a... or, like, jogs after work and then does some painting. I don't know. That could be, like, a nice balance, though. Gotta figure something out. Oh. 
Could you come repair this? You wanted to learn uh, handiness anyways. What are you trying to do? Just chit chat? No, you broke the toilet. Now he has to fix it. <laughs> this is what you get for breaking the toilet. Uh, go make a plug in. Oh, does she just want to do something romantic? I mean, you guys can kiss afterwards. That's fine. It's going to take him a little bit, so. Might as well take advantage of that time. Does this help with your burnout? No. But at least it's something different. Constantly working on our skills. Grind it out. Let's go. Level up in handiness skills. Shouldn't you be happy? Did you not? Were you like this close? He was this close to to getting to level up. Are you joking? Oh, that's so frustrating. Okay, come here and kiss her. And then I do want to rub the belly and talk to the belly. <laughs> Ask the due date. When are we due? I like that that's like sometimes okay to say and it's not always the mischievous thing because it's like sometimes you do want to be like when are you due when is the baby coming Dad. big old kisses Bobo Winubu. <laughs> i would assume soon i kind of wish it would come up with like a pop-up about it <gasps> oh <laughs> Baby Sunny. <laughs> I do like that name. I actually think that's like so good. Oh, here, do you want to talk about your fears? Let's see. How do we do that? Friendly? Probably? Does it tell me? Talk about really under romantic. Okay, so it's under romantic. My assumption. Here we go. This way he can, can be like, no, 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 don't worry about it. I'm madly in love with you. I, I, you have no reason to fear. Promise. Oh, good. Rose put herself forward and opened a line of communication, but the problems aren't over. Maybe another day of communicating. Her worries will finally help overcome her fears. Yes, I hope so. Because they're unnecessary fears. What's this one? Now she has to be funny in a crowded place. Great. <laughs> Great. Why do you have to have so many fears? Goofy. He has a fear of failure. Can you, can you talk about that? Become recognized for your work. Click on a crafted object and select show off work. Alternatively, while at work, you can click on your portrait and change your way of actively to ask for a performance review. Oh, maybe we should do that. That might be helpful. <gasps> You're not burnt out anymore. Oh, thank God. I'm so glad. <laughs> the glory of stories. Yeah, you can like stories. I like stories. You can like stories. Stories are fun to talk about. I tell stories over and over again. I don't mind. I also don't mind hearing stories over and over again. <laughs> It's great. It's good fun. Okay, he's energized. Can you do an energized painting? I can't remember the paintings that we can make. Nah. I think you have to be like sad, focused, angry, flirty. We could get flirty and do a flirty painting. Maybe that would be a good one. Come over here and take a steamy shower. Become very flirty. What do you need to do? You guys need to go on another date, but I don't know. <laughs> I'm like, eh, I'm not in the mood for a date. So maybe we could switch this over to family? I mean, either way, you have to spend a thousand on kids stuff, which I think is going to be super easy. So any of these, any of these, I feel like is a good one. What do you get for this? Matriarch? Provides skill boosts whenever they are around their children. Successful lineage. Vicarious. You can gain skills to contribute to your own. Or the super parent where you can become a role model. 
and provide bonus character values uh, gains when near toddler. You know what? I like super parent. I think we're going to do the super parent one. I haven't spent a thousand on anything. What do you mean? <laughs> I don't think I have children's stuff. Do I have children's stuff? I disagree, but you know what? I'll take it. I don't care. So we have to become a parent, achieve level four in parenting skill, and then discipline our toddler, child, or teen. So we might be swapping back and forth between a bunch of different aspirations for now, but I think that's okay. Uh, use the... Oh, the freaking shower's broken! <sighs> Repair that for me, Kyle. You're not even flirty from your shower, so I'm a little upset. You are going to have a child, don't you worry. We're very, very, very close to that. Why don't you come here and take a nap? I'm hoping... Yeah, there it is. I was like, I'm hoping he levels up from at least, you know, fixing the shower this time. Why is everything broken? Kyle, you're just going to have to get super handy because... <laughs> you're the one who wanted to get handy. Now you're just going to be super handy. You're level nine in knitting? You could make a onesie. Wait. I want to just see what his, um, what his stuff was. And he's a level nine in knitting. No, no, no. You have to become a knitter. You have to knit a onesie because that's too damned cute. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Start crafting newborn and toddler onesies. Let's go. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so we need... Oh, none of these are yellow. Which one works? I guess we could do the teal and, like, with the orange frog, I think, works. Or, like, the calico cat could work. What is, like... Well, let me look at the main motives of this. That's cute. Isn't it adorable? I'm so excited. Kyle's going to make the onesies. Let's see. Mm-hmm. Okay, interesting. Like, actor. They're gonna be an actor. Extraordinaire. <laughs> hmm. I guess that doesn't really tell me, like, everything that I want to do with this one, but that's fine. Is it, is it different from, let me see, is it different from newborn onesies? <gasps> it is. There's a yellow star and there's a yellow newborn. I think it has to be the star. They're going to be the star. They're going to be a star. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm way too excited. Why am I apologizing? I get to be excited. This is going to be the sweetest damn thing. Oh, Brian wants to come over. He's asking Kyle. Kyle, you have a buddy. I didn't know you had a buddy. Oh, that's so good. You guys can hang out. You don't even know this man, apparently. Well, here, why don't you meet Brian? How do you have a friendship and you don't even know each other? It seems very odd. I mean, thanks for hanging out and helping around the house while Rose is pregnant and... We're trying to figure out how this is going to work. I guess I should, um, probably should make that into a nursery, shouldn't I? I didn't really think about it until just this second, but I probably should make this into a nursery. I'm going to get rid of this and this. No, I wanted to get rid of that. Where did it go? Get rid of that. There we go. Um... Oh, I forgot there was a note. I forgot that note was there. Well, I mean, here, just put it on the desk for now. I didn't know we had tissues either. Oh, did, were these tissues from our date? Rude, but I, you know what? That's fine. Uh, We have a lot of artwork now, too, that I feel like we should put up on the wall because Kyle's an artist. So we'll put that there. Oh boy, there's not going to be any space for stuff, is there? 
Why? Why did this have to become difficult all of a sudden? Um, can we... You know what? Put this back. This can go here. I think they should be able to get around that fine. And then we're going to make this into like a half nursery because I think we're going to have to move next time. Uh, so, so yeah, <laughs> we're going to have to move. We're going to have to make them a new house because I don't think this is going to work for too long. Like when they're a baby, sure. But once they become a... I got to get the rose color, right? Or do we have to get it? Does it have to be yellow since they're going to be the yellow gen? No, I'm going to get it in the rosy pink because she's a, she loves rose colors. Um, But I'm thinking once... Once the baby's a infant, it's going to be really difficult to be in this house. And I think they have enough money, right? Let me see. So the lot value is 31,000 and we have 20 grand. So I think we have enough money to move and make like a bigger house. And I, I do like the idea of maybe getting one onto the top of the hill somewhere. Because otherwise we're going to live across from our bestie. So we're either going to move over here. Or, or I guess it would be this house. We're going to move here. Or <laughs> we're going to move around the corner and on top of that hill back there. Um, which I think could be kind of like a nice, quiet area to live. So I wouldn't be opposed to moving there at all. I think that would be kind of like a nice space. But if you guys have thoughts and ideas... All I know is we have to build a basement because my paranoid sim is probably going to just live down there. She'll feel so much better in the basement. Can you... Oh, there's not really a place to sit. Can you sit here? No, because she has to, like, scoot in, don't you? I thought... I thought with, like, the coffee table they'd still be able to, like, scooch around it. Hold on. Maybe I just need to... I'm just going to put the coffee table here and see if he can't sit down. Sit. Oh, good. Okay, so now we can. And I think they can still get through here, so I don't think there's any worries. So resume your project. The onesie. I'm so happy. Oh, We're getting kisses. You know, it was kind of funny, because none, none of us imagined Kyle Kyleson being being the love of our life but then he ended up being the love of our life and it's kind of adorable why won't you knit come here and sit down and knit god damn it <laughs> i really want this onesie why won't you knit what's the problem i feel like something's wrong must be in inventory. So it's in your inventory. Resume. But it's not like coming up or anything. Reset? Wait. Uh oh. Knit. Resume. Newborn. Why? You should be able to sit on the couch and knit. I don't understand. Don't place it in the world. I keep trying to place it in the world. Resume onesie. Okay, how about an object? Make um some sort of decoration. I'm confused. Make the yellow octopus. Okay, so he can make the yellow octopus, but why can't you make the onesie? Do I have to cancel the onesie and make it again? I'm wondering if there's just like a small problem there's like a little glitch happening with that one, so I might have to just remake it. I love that she just autonomously is going to be working out, like, constantly. Maybe she's just feeling super self-conscious about the baby bump. <laughs> I feel like that's a possibility. That happens. I think you look fantastic, though. You're looking great. You got massive abs for having that baby bump. I'm just saying. 
So he's just, I'm just going to have him knit away then. Enjoy your knitting. See if he can't get the, the, the octopus done first, and then I'll have him try doing the other one. Newborn onesie. So I think that was the best. <gasps> the bees and flowers one, though, could be so cute, too. Here, do this one first, though, and then I'll have you do the bees and flowers, and then we'll just... Because it has a little yellow in it, right? There we go. Okay, so I think there's just something broken with the, the other one that he was doing. Oh, I'm so excited that he's, like, so good at knitting. That's the best thing ever. I don't even have to try very hard. He's just going to knit everybody everything. I'm going to have him make uh, Rose a sweater. He's going to make himself a sweater. There's going to be baby onesies everywhere, toys everywhere. It's going to be great. Stop having the fear of failure. Knock it off. You're with your buddy. You guys were hanging out. You're having a good time. Unnecessary. Why can't you just take, like, a regular shower? It seems so odd that they can't, like, take a regular shower in this shower. I don't know if that's, like, a problem, too, or if I'm just going insane. Should be fine. You can tell Rachel loves fiber arts. That's right. That is correct. Yarn everywhere. All right? My little Grim says yarn everywhere. <laughs> I could pick up another thing. My football buddy. Yarn everywhere. <laughs> My little Harvey. Yarn everything. Yarn everywhere. <laughs> I'm done. I'm sorry. Uh, I just think it's I just think it's cute and silly. This is just the way it goes. You're fine. Oh no, which one is the broken one? Are they both broken now? I think they're both broken now. You know what, it's fine. Go to bed. It is midnight. Oh, honestly, you don't go to bed. Why didn't your hygiene go up? What do you mean? I liked the shower and now I'm like regretting it. I might just put in a regular like full shower. I guess take a steamy shower and then I was gonna have you do some stargazing and then go to sleep. Cause I wanna get that I wanna get that logic skill up as as much as we can. Third trimester in nine hours. We're so close. We're about to have the baby. Well, we're, we're not about to have the baby. We're going to still have a full trimester to go through, but it's okay. <laughs> Get that logic skill up. Honestly, if you were focused, it'd be better, but you're not getting focused. So it's, it is what it is. We got to max that one out, max out the fitness skill, and then max out parenting. And I think with four kids, maxing out parenting is probably not going to actually be an issue. There you go. Ah, a little relaxation. Oh, nope, never mind. Kyle's awake. <laughs> Time to take care of Kyle. Okay, so you're not burnt out anymore, so I can actually have you work on your painting skill, which I think is a good idea. So why don't you do ooh, pop art? I feel like you'd like pop art. Do a medium pop art painting. And then maybe we'll have you... Do you go to work today? You don't work today, so that's actually okay. Oh! We got a promotion by doing literally nothing! <laughs> she has to work today, I guess because of her last day of work it gave us that. So we're either going to become a covert operator. The covert op branch is the part of the military that no one talks about. You will be required to undergo secret tasks by planting bugs and listening uh, in on the unsuspecting. You will need to interrogate any and all suspicious individuals. No one can be trusted. And everyone is up to something. Are you up for the task? Or the officer. In the officer branch, you will be continue you will continue to earn medals while you raise rise through the formal ranks of the military. The officer path will see you earning the highest rank possible and becoming a grand marshal. To build your leadership skills, you will be tasked 
to order others and build to peak physical fitness. No grand marshal can be outdone by a raw recruit. I kind of want to be the covert up. I was super into the whole like men in black thing when we were doing the the strangerville stuff you think the officer should we should we t should we put put this to a vote i think we should put this to a vote to be quite honest let me put a poll up and you guys can help me choose between the covert operator or the officer imagine going the first route and s suspecting your wait Starting to suspect your baby. <laughs> like the baby is up to something. <laughs> what? What did I do? What did I do? What do you mean, please? Please what? All right. Um, which branch? Question mark. Should we become the covert operator? Or the officer? Let me know. I just like the covert operator because of, like, the men in black thing. And we had a bunch of those, like, running around. And since we did, like, the whole Strangerville thing, <laughs> it kind of just made sense. I'm going to go two minutes. Starting now. Get your votes in now. Anybody in the chat, welcome to vote. Get those in. What should we do? We're already cuckoo enough. <laughs> but that's why I thought it would be perfect. The evidence eraser. I mean, that's true. So we become an evidence eraser. <laughs> or a fourth lieutenant. Get your votes in. What should we do? I'm not going to vote. I'm staying out of it. I'm not going to vote. So it's going to be up to you guys what we end up being. So far... You guys have it tied because you like to drive me insane. Because you like to drive me absolutely insane. <laughs> it is tied. What are you trying to do to me? Thank you. Thank you, somebody. <laughs> I just saw it like bounce up. Dang it. Why are you guys doing this to me? You know, if you don't choose, I get to choose. Then it has nothing to do with you. So... Then you know what I'm going to pick. So if you really want the opposite of what I'm going to pick, you guys got to pick it yourself. I'm not I'm not dealing with this. This is just on you guys. I'm just saying. <laughs> this is on you guys. We're either going to become the covert operator where we race evidence and we're like part of the men in black or we become the officer and we rise to the ranks and become the head of pretty much the military, right? The grand marshal. <laughs> What's it going to be? You have 30 seconds. Everybody in chat is welcome to vote. It's in the chat right there. Click whichever one you'd like. Add some more of your points if you'd like to. Do whatever you want to. You got 10 more seconds. It's tied again. What's it going to be? Hurry. Hurry. <laughs> Get your votes in. What's it going to be? Da, 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 da. We're going to be an officer. The opposite of what I expected you guys to pick, honestly. I'm surprised you're picking officer, but I'm going to let it. I'm going to allow it. That's totally fine. We're going to be an officer. And apparently, Rose is super cheerful. Honestly, that is super cute. Wait, that's so cute, though, because she's pregnant and she's super happy. She's married, pregnant, getting promotions, all of these giant things happening in her life, and she's just so cheerful about it. That's so cute. I'm taking it. I'm taking it. So now we are a fourth lieutenant. She's going to make an additional eight per hour for a grand total of 104 per hour. Also a bonus of 1,299 simoleons. Military grade flagpole, an air award, and new clothes. All right, I got to see all of these different awards and stuff that she got. And she's also going to go into work today. Make my life a little bit easier. Oh, wait, where is it? It's up here now. So we got our next badge, and we must be able to fill this up fully, which is kind of cool. So I'm excited to be able to fill up all of her badges. And then, what else did you get? There it is. All right, well, we have to put our, our flag pull out, right? Gotta put the official flag out. Oh, I like that one, because it actually has, like, something on it. That's fun. 
Where do we want to put this? I don't know where to put this. Oh, maybe up front. We put it out here? Does it- it doesn't wave or anything? It's just kind of there? <laughs> I guess it's just kind of there. That's- that's fine. I like it. Rose has reached the max number of times she can embrace a self-discovery trait. So, okay, so what are we then fully? Paranoid, romantic, active, cheerful, family-oriented, and erratic. We also are the hero of Strangerville, have some home turf, aspirations, and of course their fears that I don't even want to talk about because <laughs> I hate them. <laughs> I mean, I don't hate them. It's fun having fears, but it's also like, oh my god, why? Why are you always afraid of everything? Here, go to work. Get up and get your butt to work. Oh. Self-discovery. With our big old tummy. Alright, go on. Get to work. <laughs> Calm down. Kyle's over here making art. Feeling good. Making art. Can you... Can you get... Can you view this and get, like, inspired to... Or, like, feel an emotion or something. Trying to figure out how to get him to feel some other emotions. Alright, sell it to a collector. Make some money off of it. Oh, wait, you got your clear mind. Can we go on a mindful walk? I always forget about that. Do not see it. Never mind. I thought there would be a mindful walk, but there isn't. So why don't you just try to become focused or something? And then we'll do another painting. No, oh, you're you're going into work. You're already at work, aren't you? She works in 52 minutes. I don't know why it asked me twice about that, but that's okay. <laughs> Aw, that didn't get... Ugh. I was so hoping... Content with a clear mind from recovering from burnout. Yeah, I was hoping that was like the mindful walk because then we can get specific uh, emotions from a mindful walk, which is always nice. Um, it's fine. Just do some more artwork. Enjoy yourself. I need you to work on that onesie, though, very soon. Because she goes into work in 20 minutes. That's fine. Can we work on this? No, see, it doesn't come up anymore. We're gonna have to frog it. No! I don't want to frog our progress. Oh, they're chit-chatting. Aww. She's so pregnant. <laughs> I love how pregnant she is. Ah, look at her! Yes! Oh, she looks so good in a uniform. It's great. That's so good. She looks fantastic in uniform. Look at that. The green with the red red hair and everything. Beautiful. Rose is off to work. Kyle's hanging out here. You might as well work hard. Because you're not burnt out or anything. Oh, we do need to get more charisma though now. So we need charisma and to practice speech at some point. Because we're going to be like the leader. I don't think it mattered which one we chose, right? Did, was it any branch? Oh. I think we were supposed to do the covert operator branch. It does say to do the covert operator branch. That must be why it was like stuck in my head to do it. Technically, yeah, it's military covert operator. Oh God, wait, I don't know. If, I don't think you can switch it. I think I'd have to go back down to, like, the other level and go back up to change it. Dang it! I thought it was either pathway. I didn't think it mattered. Ah! Well, you know what? Screw it. She's gonna do one and then become a covert operator. I'll fix it. Don't worry. <laughs> Don't worry. She's going- she's going to do some work and- and rise in the ranks and then to be- and then be recruited by the men in black. For her work on the Strangerville mystery. We'll, we'll make it part of the story. I'm not I'm not worried. I'm not worried about it. Don't worry, don't, don't, you guys don't worry about it. I'm not going to worry about it. It's fine. <laughs> Can I fix your frogs though here? Oh my god. 
The onesie is totally broken and I'm upset. I'm upset. Hold on. Yeah, I know. You with your little heart fingers. I don't think we can ever... Why can't we make the onesie? What is the problem? Okay, you are not allowed to get up. You have to do this in one sitting. Your your needs are perfect right now. Do not stop knitting that damned onesie because otherwise I'm going to have three of them that we can't frog. It's so broken. It's so broken. I'm just going to watch him this entire time. Oh, look, now we actually can be emotionally mindful. This is what I'm talking about. This was exactly what I was talking about. I wanted to go for a mindful walk. We'll do that after this, though. I don't know how many hours it's going to take him to make this onesie. But you're not moving from this couch until you make that onesie. How are your needs? I'm keeping your needs up. I will cheat your needs so that onesie gets made. Oh, she's going to call. What's up? Hey, Rose. I've been thinking about getting to know Paul better. Yeah, go for it. Go for it. <laughs> more friends i say no 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 daydreaming no nothing what is this he just wants to daydream about his true love you are definitely a love bug 100 percent a love bug he's almost done with it no oh did he finish it did, did, he, did he finish it oh thank god he finished it okay so we finished our knitting project he's super happy it's excellent quality I am 100 Oh, wait, wait, can we just keep it? Oh, click on the bassinet to dress a newborn. Okay, so we get to just keep it, and it's there. Yay! Oh, I'm happy. I don't... The other ones are broken, though, and I can't get them to go away now. <laughs> I'm sad about that, but at least, at least it's working out nicely. I'm happy. Is there any more yellow things that we could do? We could do the yellow turtle. We could do a yellow llama, a yellow penguin... I think we should do all of these, to be quite honest. I'm just happy it's working now. That's all I that's all I needed. Oh wait, no, you need to go for your mindful walk, don't you? Did I miss my opportunity? I missed my opportunity. <laughs> I had to. I had to keep going. It's not my fault. Okay, so he's just gonna keep on working on these. We do need to sell another painting, so that's fine. Clean this out. Polish this perfection. If it's a yellow penguin, is it just a chick? I don't know. Does... No. Maybe? It still has, like, the different wings. It still would be a flightless bird. <laughs> I understand the thought, though. Because it does- it, I would think the same thing, honestly. Okay, so now we have a yellow octopus, we have a yellow turtle, Timmy the turtle, a perfect companion, it's legendary. Kyle's amazing at knitting. Honestly, he should just start, like, selling, like, the- the knitting projects on on uh, Plopsy too, technically, but they can also glide a little bit. <laughs> so maybe they are. Maybe a yellow penguin is a chicken. Discuss. <laughs> All right, go to the bathroom. You need to sell this to a collector. What a weird art project. Boat is closed. Rose is back from work. Oh no. Too many Sims. She's not feeling too good about the picking this branch. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. I, maybe she's like, oh, maybe... Maybe military opera. It's just not the. It's just not right for me. Fourth lieutenant might have been a bad choice. Like ah, and then she just doesn't know. And then she gets recruited. 
She does need to take a nap, though. She's exhausted. She's absolutely exhausted. Go to bed. Kyle's gonna make dinner, so you might as well just get comfy, go to sleep. Kyle's apparently also taking a nap. Never mind. Who's gonna have him make dinner? Uh, you could make... Make some grilled cheese. Yeah, get that grilled cheese going. Very good. So I figured she was hungry. I mean, she's... Wait, I told you to go to sleep, and then she took a nap. <sighs> Your sleeping would have gone up... Like, her energy would have gone up so much faster if she just went to sleep. <laughs> I wasn't paying enough attention to her. I gotta, I gotta apparently micromanage my Sims a bit more. Okay, let's see. Ooh, ooh, you're flirty. Wait, yes. Come here and make a flirty painting. Stop talking and go make a flirty painting. Go, go, go. And she passes out. Well, that's not my fault. That's your fault for not sleeping like I told you to. <laughs> you are currently in your third trimester. We don't know when the baby's gonna come. Uh, ridiculous. Get to bed. Oh, that's an interesting choice. I mean, I guess, is this, like, about your costumes and... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know where he's going with this one. <laughs> I'm gonna sell that. Woo! One star celebrity. All right. All right. That's fine. That's fine. Be a celebrity. Yeah, you can't make it. You can't make energized. You're always energized. Constantly energized. Okay, go to bed. Aww. Aww, the cuddles. The cuddles. It's so cute. Okay, I kind of figured you were going to end up waking up. I mean, third trimester, you're probably... That bladder is getting pushed on and kicked. Oh, you didn't make it. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Yeah, take a shower. Go do what you need to. All right, that's my bad. I, I mean, not really. I mean, you did wake up to go to the bathroom just a little too late. Just a little too late. Okay. She's back to feeling flirty though. I don't think there's a puddle. I don't see a puddle on the floor. So I guess at least you didn't make a puddle. Back to bed you go. My poor Sims. So let's see. Who's going to get up then first? Kyle's going to get up first. Kyle's making breakfast. What do you want to make? Some scrambled eggs and bacon. She's going to have to get up to use the bathroom again. Look how fast it's going down. That's crazy. I don't trust it. I'm making her go downstairs right now. She wants to chat. Be funny in a crowd. Kyle is making breakfast. Do not eat grilled cheese right now. You're getting your breakfast. Uh, or not, because now we have a fire. Oh, good good lord. Okay, can you... Kyle, stop cooking! There's a fire! <laughs> okay, he's on fire. He's on fire. Go extinguish yourself right now. I forgot there was an alarm! That scared the crap out of me! Oh my god. Bird, baby bird, no! Uh, uh, wait, she's brave. She's brave. Extinguish. Wait, the firemen are here. The firemen are here. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Do something. Come on. 
Get in here. Get rid of the fight. No, the carpeting! No, I loved that rug. Our entire house is on fire. Oh my god! <laughs> Man, I swear, it's on fire. Let's keep cooking. I mean, I, I guess if you're feeling... No, come on! F you're jumping to fire! Well, Kyle had to go to work, so I guess he's at work now. Can we please extinguish the rest of this? It's in the bathroom! Are you joking? Okay, okay. Yeah, go to work, because now we need money to fix the entire damned house. Half the fr- And she's gone into labor?! Half the- Half the kitchen is burned to the ground, and we've gone into labor. It's fine. It's 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 fine. I'm just gonna- I'm gonna replace everything really quick. We have the money right now. It's fine. I'll have to replace that later. We're going to get the new couch. We have to clean up the, 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 the floor. We have to get a new carpeting. But I guess for now, we probably should head to the hospital, right? We have to get to the hospital. Look on the bright side. You're about to have a lovely baby. It's going to be great. You know, I'm glad you can just look right on the, <laughs> the bright side of life right now. <laughs> A house fire would put you into labor? That's a good point. The stress of this probably put her into labor, honestly. Um, let's have the- I'm thinking have the baby at the hospital, you know? We'll join you. Can we bring Kyle? Apparently Kyle's not gonna make it. That's fine. Everything's fine. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. <laughs> Hi, Tay! Welcome on in! <laughs> Oh my god, how are you doing today? The firemen were complaining about the dirt. Seriously, seriously, house is on fire, off to work. The chaos of that moment just now, I swear to god, I swear. Hey boss, my baby daddy burnt our kitchen down and then my water broke. Can't come in, I'll see you later. <laughs> maybe they're really understanding, you know? Maybe, maybe that's okay. You're fine. You're okay. You got this. I, I I believe in you, Rose. Your neck is sore from the concert last night. That's fair. I would imagine... No, no, no. You, no, no, no. You're not going to work. We just talked about this. You're having a baby. I'm not gonna make you go to work in labor. Y you just come home and have the baby anyways. Cut everybody in line. And get your butt into that doctor's room. <laughs> but work. No. <laughs> this guy's complaining that she's in front of him in pain. I have problems with this. Oh my god. Go on. Get to the back. It's baby time. Who's gonna be our doctor? This is what I'm curious about. <gasps> She's even have like a rose colored gown. Apparently handsome pretty boy over here is our doctor. What's your name? Asumo. Well then. I feel like he's got like that pretty boy face. I don't know why. Now what? Oh, the bills? We have to pay our bills now too? Look, I'm having a baby. Let me deal with that first. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. This guy doesn't seem like he knows what he's doing. I'm a little concerned. I'm a little concerned. Wanna be our next baby daddy? No. She is with the love of her life. <laughs> we are not doing that. <laughs> When it rains, it pours. Seriously, though. But we've had a baby boy! Yay! 
And we cut, we came up with our name, but we are going to need more names. So if you guys have any name suggestions for the next three babies, we will need them. That's going to be the yellow generation, the sunflower generation, if that helps with name ideas. But our first baby boy is named Sunny. Sunny Rivers. Welcome to the world. Yay! I love that the baby pops in and then it gets slammed down on top of it. That is such a weird thing. They need to fix that. <laughs> it's just slightly awkward. Oh, I love that you decided to wear your colander hat for this part, Rose. That's perfect. <laughs> She's like, look, I'm paranoid. We're at a hospital, okay? This is this is what I have to deal with. Aw, big old Aww. kisses for the newborn. Oh. Special times call for special occasions. Oh. Bye bye, baby. I'll I'll see you at home, I suppose. Yeah. The nice part is all of our needs will be better. So even though her needs like were horrendous from that fire, at least we're better now. Goldie. Goldie's kind of cute too though. I kind of like that. Hold on. I'm gonna Oh wait, no, I have I have I immediately go to my sticky notes when I'm like, no, I actually have my my one note now for this. So we have Goldie. Any other names, always let me know. But one baby at a time, I think, because now we're gonna have to end up moving into a new place. Go ahead, put your outfit on. You don't have to be wearing that at home. Oh. I I guess you could go to work. I thought you were gonna, you were have like family leave. Why don't you have family leave? Oh, it's dead. Oh no. I guess it would be dead, right? Because it's, because it's the mother plant, the mother plant's dead? That's fine. Well, baby's at daycare because mom and dad both wanted to go to work today. I guess that's fine. <laughs> Why? No, we are in compliance. We have a we have a solar panel. Go away. Keep it. It looks pretty. I'm going to. Don't worry. I'm, I don't want to dispose of the dead plant because I think it's cool. I wanted them to have like a bunch of bizarre plants, or at least that was going to be a part of the the garden for her generation. That and roses. So we're gonna have to get some roses, and we'll have the the bizarre fruit. Lord, I thought Sunny was dead. Oh, God, no. No, Sunny's fine. Sunny's at daycare. God, no. <laughs> it's like he didn't live that long. Oh, no. That's so sad. It's okay. Kyle will be back from work and we'll get to meet the baby. It'll be okay. Go away. We have solar panels. Well done. Looks like the house is in compliance. Thank you. Get out of here. We also have to pay our bills. So hopefully Kyle gets home so we can pay the bills and everything. Saved by firefighters. Those firefighters arrived in just the nick of time. That was a close one. I guess if you want to think of it that way. Sure. <laughs> Come on, Kyle. Get your butt home. Congrats on the new addition. That's my doctor. My doctor called me to say congratulations on your new addition. <laughs> oh boy. It's it's cool. It's cool. All right, so Sunny's back from daycare. Kyle, you're kind of stinky, but I want you to meet the new baby. I want you to give uh, <gasps> you need to dress the newborn in the onesie and then big old cuddles for our newborn baby. Oh my god, wait, no, you're disgusting. No cuddles yet. Go take a shower first. <laughs> That's how you went to work? Completely singed? Your hair is black. Oh my god. The doctor wants to be the baby daddy. Truly. Truly does. Okay, come come now to, to cuddle our new baby in their new onesie. You look like a little old man. Oh, look how cute. So much has happened today. We have... You're still stinky. Why are you still stinky? I told you to take a shower. 
Game, what is with my sims not showering fully when I tell them to shower? <laughs> it's fine. Rose is home now. Kyle's home. We're gonna learn all of the things. Oh god, Rose has a mental fog. I don't know if I can handle this. I don't know if I can handle this right now. We've had so much happen today. Here, get the mail quick. We need. We do need to pay the bills before they turn off all of our stuff. Oh, Kyle just had a eureka moment. All right, that's cool. <sighs> but since we have had so much to happen, we have married Kyle. So Kyle Kyleson is now our husband. We got promoted a bunch. So we're actually at level six of our career, which is kind of cool. But we might have to switch career branches, but that's okay. It could be a part of the story. We have also had a baby named Sunny, which is our first baby. And we actually did a little bit of a house renovation. So our house is kind of ridiculous. But I'm thinking we might have to build a house in between here. <laughs> I'm excited to build them a house. So I'm trying to come up with the design idea for it. I, I guess it should fit in with Strangerville. So we'll probably just go with like that Strangerville design and maybe a bit of like ranch style home. Um, a bit of that like classical like look to it. So we'll probably do that in between parts here. So I, I, cause I love building and you guys know I love building. So I think that'll be kind of perfect. And then we'll continue their story. It'll be really fun. It'll be really great. Kyle's um, at least done with burnout, but now we're going to have to deal with Rose's burnout. But I'm I'm proud of Kyle for, for going in and, and doing his passion of art. It's, it's lovely. It's so lovely. And Rose just cleans up so well in her, her uniform. <laughs> She's beautiful. I love her. All right. But I am tired. And I do need a break. <laughs> So let me, and I do want to eat my dinner because I'm really hungry now too. So let me find a place for us to raid. Thanks guys for joining me though. I hope you had fun. I hope you had a good time with Rose and Kyle and all of those good things. I'll have, I'll have Rose behind us while we, while we say goodbye. Um, let's see, where could we go off to? There's always like a thousand different places that I feel like we could we could join in on here. Let's see. Where have we gone in a while? Or should we go to like some more simming? We could go to a new place. That's always fun too. I like doing that. Let's see. Tomorrow we're going to probably play our new game. That's what I'm planning on doing. We did a game vote. You guys, of course, tied it up because you just drive me crazy. And um, we now have <laughs> a game we will be playing tomorrow. And I think it's going to be a good time. Let's see. Oh, here we go. We could go here. This could be fun. Yeah. Yeah, let's go do this one. Um, <laughs> but I will pick and it'll be a surprise for tomorrow. I'm not going to tell you until until we get into our moment of it. But I think it's going to be a lot of fun. I think you guys are going to enjoy it and have a good time with it. And then, um, yeah. I'll make sure to add uh, an extra stream this weekend so we can do some crocheting. And make our little Grimm character. We'll make some Grimms together. Because I, I really want to make a bunch more of these. Um, and I love him. I just love my Grimm. So I think it would be fun to have some more of them. Especially since the new, new pack is coming out. The new expansion pack. I'm really, really excited about it. I don't know what else to say. I think that's it. I think that's all I got. So, rest well, Rach. Thanks. I need it. I honestly need it. I need a break. I need to have some fun. But let's get this raid started. Oh, let me put in all my little things, too. Follow me on all my socials and all of those places. Go check out my podcast. Rate, review, subscribe. The new uh, se the new season's coming out very, very soon, so get excited for that. Go join our Discord and the fun community that we have. And then I also have a YouTube channel where I'm having a lot of fun. And I do a lot of Sim stuff over there. So if you, if you like the Sim stuff, go over there. Enjoy all of that. 
but we're going to go check out a new person that we haven't been to before. So this is going to be great. Let me get the raid started. And you guys can use the raid call or the sub raid. We're heading on over. So we're going to go say hi and we're going to have a good time. <laughs> They're doing the not so berry challenge. So I thought it'd be kind of fun to head on over there. But thank you guys so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you had fun. Keep crafting, keep gaming, stay lazy. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. See you later. Bye. <laughs>